Oh, hi everyone, and welcome back to the live stream. Uh, we're uh, tier two. Um, Dave, will you sit down? Sit down. Um, Bossy bugger, aren't you? Yeah, it's, uh, it's tier two uh, <coughs> nationals now, um, or as it will be rebranded, the championship. Um, <laughs> we've not had this discussion, but I, I think no. it's, it's a gore. Um, so we're going to have Leeds up against Birmingham first. Um, full check in this one. Um, tier two is an interesting. You've played in tier two a bit, Dave. I've played plenty of tier two hockey. Yeah, yeah. and it's that it's that an enviable mix of of good solid hockey players and people who just fly like a cannonball around the rink. Yeah. No. I was the latter, I think. Yeah. Well, fly might have been an ex exaggeration, but yeah. And, and while while we're here, um, let's uh, let's talk shop. Um, how how did you get on? How you feel you got on this morning? Your first uh, debut in goals. It was all right, really. Your first career win. My first career win. First, first slap shot finding a gap in the padding and busting my knee. <laughs> well, that's, that's all it goes with the territory. Then, that's all right. Yeah. Hey? Uh, if that's all it busts, then that's not too bad. No, well, yeah. But a bit of blood earlier on on, uh, on Dave. Yeah, well, yeah, that was my knee. Yeah. Um, I think we've only, we've only got a few hours left. We've done. Yeah. We're ahead a little bit, and the, the leads are just on, just having a skate around. Well, no, we've still got another four hours at this now. We're still scheduled to finish half one, uh, half in right? So yeah, but I think we'll hopefully finish before then. Oh, you're ever an optimist, aren't you? Ever the optimist. Ever the optimist. You have to be as a Scottish rugby fan. <laughs> Normally you have to be as a Bristol rugby fan as well. Yeah, <laughs> Bristol winning today. Yeah, spoilers, but yeah, yeah. over the mighty Saracens. Earlier on we gave you the IES uh, women's uh, and men's All-Stars again and the GBU teams. Mm -hmm. Those will be tweeted and Facebooked out later once I've done the typo corrections. Thank you, Rambo. I surely can't take that one. You know, so. No, I can't. But. <laughs> Very busy. Oh, yeah. and you look at this. Hey. Old man Zimmerman's joining us. Do you want to do a guest, a guest commentary? Yeah, put, put old man Zimmerman on. Yeah, do you want to put your feet up? Uh, we're running ahead. We were running ahead. Um, but now, we're, well, we're still ahead. We're optimistically going, but... Um, yeah. Even even with crutches, he's still the coolest guy in the room, isn't he? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I might need to borrow those actually after my bad knee. Oh, look look at that. Very nice. Very nice. Imperial uh, imperial tie there. I'm loving the glamour shots you did a few years back. I found those a while back. Uh, was it in the in your in your lab or something? Wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> glamour shots, eh? Yeah. Very nice. Very nice. Giving a two-minute delay game oh, penalty to oh, Birmingham here. Right, I'm off. I'm off. I'm oh, being served. Ne yeah, Nick's having none of you sitting in that chair. No, yeah, no, 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 no. Chair. I might be commentating on you later, though. Oh, one. absolutely, because Nick will be on nice. Um, wait, before before we go, before you go, put, put the headphones on and uh, on Gus a second. Right, Gus, hello. If you could if you could summarise Ben Lakey's uh, play in a in a few words, just for people who are looking forward to the IES game. Um, hits, like a tank. It just runs people over, like a train. I think someone used that in commentary last year. So, uh, look forward to the probably hits. probably me, to be honest with you. It'd be a lot of fun. Yeah, do, do you know that he sent me clips of me commentating on them? Oh, yeah, I told him to, actually. Yeah, he, and then said, I don't know if you've seen these. Yeah, no, I, that's a major error on his part. <laughs> it's a bold play. Yeah, I, I knew who he was. I don't forget people like him. So he's not here this weekend, though. Oh, well, that's a big loss for Imperial. <laughs> and yeah. uh, sa no. saved to Nick Sticker there. Um, no, he's not playing against them. So, what's your prognosis? When are you? When are you? Hopefully, uh, Mark. You're not on mic. You just cut him off. Yeah, sorry, Back sorry. skating late May, everyone. So we'll see how that goes. <laughs> Um, yeah, and you, you coach, I think, um, Joanna and... Melissa the from... Uh, they, they skate down in Streatham. A Eva Harrison, I think she was down there for a bit as well. So a few of the girls actually are coming into various viewer teams to come out from the, from the Streatham contingency. So it's Is quite good to see them. Streatham Storm? Or? Yeah, that's the team. So you, you coach Izzy as well? Yep, Izzy yeah, as so well, so I know them all. Strong pedigree coming from that, that yeah. area. Um, so yeah, you you're the head coach there, are you? Uh, assistant coach there. I've taken a step back this year to go focus on the development team there. But prior to that, we got 
the girls up to the uh, elite league, so kind of well, elite league women's hockey. Yeah. Uh, so playing up against all the kind of people playing uh, for GB and whatnot. So that's a pretty good representation of. You never know with the, the way the elite league is now; they might accept anyone into it. So <laughs> um, that's not that's not saying that the women's team don't deserve to be in it, but uh, yeah, <laughs> they're not. They're having a good time there. So um, yeah, what what should we be looking for with Joanna? Because I've actually never seen Joanna play. She's a great skater. Um, that's really, really her massive strength is just her skate and her compete. Um, so if you got any slow D, people aren't pivoting quick enough, she's going to blow by them. Nice, nice. I look forward to it. I think this um, is definitely going to be uh, a competitive IES uh, GBU series this year. Oh, with, yeah. Uh, I think the, women, the, women, the, women, the GBU women are going to be in trouble. I mean, that'll, be, that'll be a competition. First. You got any predictions for us? Um, I don't know. Who's, who's in golf for the GBU women? Uh, we've got Holly Steeples and uh, Steph Owen. All right, Holly. If Holly's playing the full game, I think I think GBU might sneak a, a goal, a one goal game, kind of uh, either way, maybe three, four goals each. Fair enough. Fair enough. Excellent. Well, thanks very much for your your time, and I uh, hope you recover as quick as possible, and we see you back in nice soon. Cheers. Thanks Cheers. a lot. So we go back to the wide lens. Uh, we're ready now for tier two. Are Birmingham ready? The question is, do Birmingham have enough players to put in the penalty box? Quadruple minor for uh, them. Did they start five on three? I didn't expect that to go that far ahead. So Birmingham start short-handed here uh, with the delay game penalty for taking. They're, they're so long. pretty used to that from last year, though. Yeah. And there we go. That's uh, that goalie will get some of the players onto the bench. Wow, they're white. They skates. were very white skates. Have you got rosters, Nick? You might have to log in with yourself. I, I don't know what my login is. Oh, well, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know yeah. mine, so just log in as me. Cross it goes, grey. Shot. Picked up, shot. Good save. This, this Birmingham goalie, good fundamentals. Rambo, are you looking forward to watching me play again? I am. I've not seen you play since uh, we played together in Finland. With obviously the one and only, uh, I'll be sharing the ice again with Mr. Astil. Oh, is he, oh, are you playing against Nottingham first? Uh, we are indeed. Good stop there. And there's jo- Josh Herter looks uh, quite uh, quite uh, a bulky individual as well. He doesn't look like a sort of you know like he's a, a he's a powerhouse. Yeah. But missing Michael Cannon might hurt him a little bit. Mind you, we just heard that MPBO are missing like. All the roster. All the roster. Nope. Oh. 
this Birmingham team, as much as we've said that the other teams struggle to score, this Birmingham team can score. Yes, with five players. Kilgore there for, uh, for Birmingham. I don't think she applied for that, yes. Birmingham have several good female ice hockey players in their 18. Watson across, that's a good pass. And then it's put in by Kilgore. I don't know if the numbers are right, actually, so I don't know why I'm saying that. Number 10 is actually Scott Cash. 13 shoots. When are we going to get the first surprise hit? But it's going to take us both by surprise when someone gets smoked. <laughs> we'll be like, ooh, big hit. Oh, yeah, it's loud. Look, there he is, Stag. Oh, nice pass to hurt her. Ooh, and that backhand's miles wide there. Kept in the zone, but when we'll get it and play it off the wall. Herter's got it now, he's going to turn it But uh, hacking and whacking there. Shot, good save. It's a good shot. Gamey, shot, another good save. Another good save! Highlight we stuff from this goalie. And we don't have Joe in the gorilla position, so there's probably no chances of an actual highlight. It <laughs> was a smart save. Ah, Michael Smart. Oh dear. Is the live stream actually on it? We've got chat and stuff, we've got people watching. We have to refresh. Eighteen people watching even though it says that. Are you wearing a kilt? I'm not wearing my kilt today. Yeah, it still says it still says BIHA non-checking to playoff final at the bottom. It's clearly not that anymore. Back to Nationals. Here's Hertha. Tier, tier, tier 5 got a lot better. <laughs> oh! There's the first hit. In anger. Oh! oh it's a wood, it's what a woodwork save! It's the Iron work in Michael Smart there, saved by the post. That was a... Oh, that and was then a, somebody blows a tire. That was a double ding. Double down. Oh! oh. It's starting, to, it's, starting to, it's starting to get physical. Is here. he, he going to wear that mouth guard in his mouth? or He's just chewing it. He's got a dog with a bone. Which I believe, is that not a penalty as well? Uh, I don't think so. Otherwise, um, Patrick Kane would never, ever um, last yeah, but, longer than about 10 but seconds. But this is the nice. thing, as we know, rules in the NHL and rules in real life are two very different things. Yeah, that's true. Like the whole, you must have your jersey tucked out. Yeah. The rules in real life and rules in real life are, are quite interesting from, uh, from from time to time too. The face off here, I think this is... What? Here's Watson. Good stop. That's Scott Cash. That was a bit dangerous by Scott Cash. Ooh. Oh! This guy's got... Oh! Hey! Steady hey, now. Hey, hey Mr. Oh! And that could be our first two plus ten. Welcome to tier two. Anything goes. What's the call here? Prison rules. Borden, two plus ten. Need to get someone to set the ten minute. That's pure will. So Birmingham Lassel. has a chance. Oh, oh. Lassel, we know he's got a wrist on the half, this boy. He must be feeling really, really fresh after last year. Is he uh, one of the famous five? He's one of the famous five, yeah. Did they bring the dog this year? I don't know if they brought the dog. I don't see Sarah Afterlek either. Um, who was oh, that's a great chance. Positively outstanding last year. Off the wall. Is that guy called Jubber? Is that his name? Oh, that was uh, ambitious. Oh, some good speed through here. Oh, heads up. That's, that's just offside. 
miles, absolutely miles offside. <laughs> They've been very generous saying that's just offside, Nick. The wall. I was trying to underplay the just. Ooh. Oh, right, the coop in. Oh, <laughs> hands up everywhere. That's just outright silliness. Charging, number six. And of course, Leeds, they've got themselves in a bit of a, a pickle here because that's penalty points for that first uh, penalty, of course. And it now it's going to be five on three for about 20 seconds by the time Leeds no, make the no change. No wonder, a guy called Gray gets the penalty. I don't think I would have taken that penalty. I don't think I'm fast enough to get charging. <laughs> <laughs> the speed gun wouldn't have gone off. By the way, I would be considering a delay game penalty for that by Leeds. They just killed like 10 seconds of the yep. 5 on 3. 10, 15 seconds of 5 on 3. Oh! That's a big save. And this is going to go 5 on 4 any second now. It's fired down the ice. Matthew Smart completely stops it. Plays it across. Good pass. Pass of the day. Oh, nice hands. Nice hands again. She's getting through. Herter, a good poke check there. And we'll now return to five on four. Wassel picks it up. This Leeds team is uh, fiery, is this when you played them through the season, Nick? Yes. Yes is the word. Because your use. whole division is here, and this is an interesting one, because this is one cross-division sort of game. Oh! Ooh. Which does unfortunately mean there's a lot of scores which have been started through the year that might get settled. Here's Watson. Tries to fire it on. You can get it on target there. Oh! -ho! Drift cover. Pylon. Reminding everyone what he can do. Boom! Stopped by Michael Smart, but he would have wanted to probably hold on to that. I think number 56 is a Solly Hill Vixen. Oh, nice hands through the zone. Well defended. Oh, yeah, you can't throw it in the net. You can try. Oh, is that that Sarah Afterlick or Afterlack? Is he good when he's joined us again? Shot. Good job, save. You're not going to beat Steeples from there. Is that, that should be a penalty. Is, that is Steeples, yeah. yeah that, that should, should be, be a penalty. penalty. Absolutely, 100%, Nick. And Joe. Joe just let a player in before the puck drop there. What have we got in the rosters here? It is Jacob Steeples, although he's got the wrong jersey on. It's Callum Jubber that we talked about earlier. He also got it. How do you get this to move? I broke it in there. Jubber. He's off the wall. Bond puts out in front. Who's his number 56 in the way? He's very good. Anna Morris. Or is Anna no, Morris? Uh, the She's 54. Velna Mataya? Velna Matilla. Oh, well, good play by Herter. And here comes Josh Herter through the zone. Top point scorer in the north. Only closely second by Michael Cannon, who's not here. Lacking some firepower. What a pass that is. Good what a save that by is. Smart there. Good pass, decent shot, better save. Here's Hertha now. Here's Hertha on an infinity shift. Shoot! Woo. Fast glove this boy. This, uh, fast glove. This kid's uh, pretty handy like. Math. Uh, what's his name? Michael Smart. Smart save. Yeah. What's, uh, anyone, anyone chiming in? Anyone chiming in? Nah. Just is he good winning? Yeah, is he good winning? Loves the, uh, she loves the Lions. Loves the Lions? Everyone loves the Lions. Apart from Leeds right now. And the poachers. Yeah, the poachers. Oh! Chopper. Ooh. Oh, it's oh. so oh. oh! Boom! Welcome to the Krivkuga show. Oh! Krivkuga. This guy's got a strong beard game as well. 
He's just got a strong everything. Could be ace in this in at the touch. I'm not sure it was, but. Oh, and there's number nine. Oh, oh, oh. There's oh a... no, it's not been called. There's a rather large amount of bullying going on. Number 19 is decked. Oh, he is calling it now. And they were off again after the injury. Puck out front. Oh, and Wassel. Oh, wow. it got a bit dangerous there for Wassel. We get out of the zone eventually. Here's Wassel. Wassel. Gemi. Taylor, oh, hit off the play then. It's, it's good to have referees up here to analyse yeah, and debate calls. Yeah. And discuss. It's oh, a, shot! It's a learning experience wow. even for me and you. After that. She was one of the Birmingham famous five. Oh, and Samuel Stagg misses that. Venla Matilla. She's got some wheels on her, Venla Matilla. Mm -hmm. Oh, good poke check. You can see the, the elevation in standard now. Yeah. Uh, Nick, as we, uh, as we move into the, uh, in, in the tier two. And then, oh, Topic by Jubber there. Yeah, elevation of standard, as we just said. Commentator's curse. Everyone po Topics sometimes. I don't know when I was doing an under-12s game and my linesman had to call the goal for me. Absolutely shamu. <laughs> oh, this goalie. Yeah, good goal to end it. Yeah, I shamu and, uh, and somebody had to call the goal for me. Did you not make the call while you were down there? <laughs> no, because I didn't see it, because I was too busy trying to check if my ribs had come out of my back. <laughs> Luckily, I had an airbag in front of me, so it stopped any permanent damage. Jumper going into the corner here. Leads me to be made to work for this. And in the same way, Birmingham had a couple of chances. Birmingham, like, this isn't totally mismatched in the... Uh... Oh, oh, there is, oh, there is oh, here's chance Wassel. that they want. Now, Wassel, he's got a wrist shot and a half. Wassel rip, loads it up, oh! See what I mean, I see the snap he gets that wrist shot off at. Talking to snap, there's Krivka, they're looking for the next oh, victim. Here's Wassel again. Wassel, oh, tries to find someone in front there. Can't find anyone. Herter, gives it to Taylor. Gemi. Oh. Here's Jubber. Bond. I think Bond was a five plus, uh, five plus one as well, wasn't he? Hitter. Oh. Show me number 48 is. Pat, oh. Matilla comes in. Keeps it oh, alive. Chance. Oh, Matilla! She's trying to find it. Trying to find it, and he just lands on her stick there. And leads her sixes and sevens here with a scramble. Everybody scramble.
apparently it's a thing in uh, Scottish weddings it used to be that you'd throw change out to everyone to scramble for. That's the most Scottish thing I've ever heard. <laughs> oh, oh, a tip! Catch! Tip in front! What a shot! I think it's tipped by 48. Who is 48? Who have we got as number 48 here? Michael Beard! I think it's Michael Beard with strong, a tip. Strong Beard game. Find out the official score, scorers uh, from the from Dave eventually. That was dramatic. It, it, a bit against the run of play, but to be honest, they're not. I can't say that Birmingham haven't been working hard in, in, in this game. So, and they've been the more disciplined the two teams. Leeds have been a bit silly right at the start with the penalties they've taken. One player, obviously, taking a two plus. In. Good play by Ooh. Oh, and I think uh, that's Scott, an elbow and a half. Scott Cash could be looking for the. Oh, oh, oh and Watson's going to get the retaliation. Watson, what are you doing, you silly boy? You cannot argue that call. You cannot argue that. Oh, you numpty! What are you? Five on four in favour of Leeds. Yeah, so it's going to be a two minute. Steps in. Oh. So, uh, guessing the Leeds boy got uh, got a ten there. No, Leeds boy got two. Two plus two for Birmingham and two minute on Leeds. So the two minutes goes on the board. Yeah. Leeds After. should actually have someone sit in the two. If the Sorry, Birmingham should have someone sitting. So the two. two minutes for Leeds goes on the board. Yeah, uh, for Birmingham goes on the board. All oh, right. I think. Yeah, it's just oh, it's on the wrong way round up up the top. To be fair, if you're Birmingham, this is a great tactic. Yeah. These little chats and these little scrums are just wasting time. So again, there, prime example of classic national hockey when you know what you're doing. You lose, uh, lose a good couple of minutes off the clock. So 1-0 the score here to Birmingham. Down the ice it goes, Gray to Richardson. Richardson steps round. Oh, and tries to set up the baseball shot. Ambitious. Three shot. Oh, oh that could have gone anywhere. High stick. Oh, oh he's and again, that whistle's a good whistle. Like, it's a good whistle. It actually probably should have been blown there because Jobber got to the puck first. Yeah, but and it, again, that's a, that's a really good whistle for Birmingham. What sort of advantage did he get off of that? Because to be honest with you, he was under a lot of pressure when he got the puck. Well, the good news is the scoreboard's back. <laughs> well, it's back to its, uh, its good old self again. And here, here comes Birmingham back to five on five. So, pure will. Oh, that's a good bump there. After leg. Kir Kirby. Oh, oh, good D. Good D there. Good stick. In the way stick Richard. in the lane. Oh, and yeah, this just needs to be a clear. There you go. That will do actually fine. a two no, on one going the other way. That will do Birmingham there, they'll be happy with that. 
we could sense our, this. Uh, the crowd can sense the first upset of Nationals, perhaps, in Tier 2 in the first game. I mean, we knew Birmingham would be, we had them ranked at three, but we really thought Leeds would be too strong for, for most. Richardson, shot. Oh! oh! And the post is smart again, and that's off the side of the net. Again, that... It's not a bad whistle. It's not a bad buzzer. <laughs> again, the clock just with a momentary element of Tourette's. Yeah, they got bad. Tony Crowell, when does the season start? Uh, the BYJ season starts around October time. Oh, and somebody's thrown off. I get, oh, doesn't really matter on the stock. What's going on? Venla Matala is going for a wee wonder. Of course, it's stop clock now, so it doesn't matter if she stops the clock or it's not. A good rest, though. Oh, and a good face-off win by her. That's important. That was textbook, that face-off win. If they can clear the zone here and get out, this is big. If they can get out the zone here, even icing the puck and do, that's even better. Leeds need to be careful and just not take a... Oh, oh and that's going to... And they're pulling they're the goalie. Pull, they're pulling the goalie. Steeples is coming. I don't think anybody else is expecting it. Steeples pulls himself. Chat. Oh, the absolute rumble behind the goal. That's Smart. a big save, big save. And Dave's there on the button, poised and ready. 13 seconds left in this tilt. If only he was that agile this morning. Here comes Herter. Herter against Wassel. And the face off here. What a big Wassel, face off win again. Excellent big face off win. That was good because the winger came in and won a face off, and then Wassel, the centre, actually won a face off. This will take down Mark. Big shot. Smart, good save. Chance. Oh, it needs his one clear, that'll do. Oh, and there we go. Birmingham will be absolutely delighted with that. Absolutely delighted. Now, we did hear on the. I did get a Twitter message that if any people from Birmingham said they would like to come and help us, if you wish to do that. Please do. Yeah, yes, we, I'm about to check out for a little yeah, while. Yeah. Well, we'll see if we can find them. I don't know if they sent it to me or to the thing. It was to me. To you? To me. To you. To you soon? Not really. I mean, we're not being, we're not actually, you know, we're honouring them for mm -hmm. something that we remember them for and loved them for. I loved the Chuckle Brothers back in the day. He is the smallest man in the BYJ again. Holstoff. He's a big tall fella, isn't he? Just a little. And here come the Wildcats, home of our BYJ players rep. Joe Gubbins. Who's the goalie for the Wildcats? Are you on after this game? No, there's an ice cut and then a game. Here come the Bears. So is this Bear C or uh, it's Bear C, yeah? I can tell you straight away. This is not the Bear C team. Toth is playing for the Bear C team. Peter Toth is someone uh, who I think is a really, really strong defenseman. So it'll be interesting to see him in tier two. And also Jordan Sullivan playing in for the C team. Jordan Sullivan hasn't played all year. I'm just saying, it might upset the phone book here, Sheffield C. Uh, They've done it already this season. They got rid of the carrot, and uh, maybe uh, someone else is leading the donkey now. Yeah. Now who's, the, who's the guy Payne? Look, 41, is that actually Payne? That's Will Oh, Payne. yeah, Will, Will Payne. Um, Will Payne you into when he scores. So here we go, we're, 
I don't know what Burn uh, Sheffield are doing. No one shut the door. There's a UN conference going over at the bench. There's what, wait a minute, what's going on here? There's two oh, people. Oh, are they finally oh. mopping up that sick from a long time ago? <laughs> That's that, been there since that this has morning. That's been there all day. Yeah. Yeah. So we're just getting that mopped up. We're just getting uh, some uh, some nastiness. Bile. Uh, bio. Biologicals mopped up. Or yak, as some of you might refer to it as. And uh, well, they're doing a good job. That was very efficient, I have to say. Very efficient. Round of applause. Yeah, well done to the Sheffield Dice stuff. Oh wow! Yeah. <laughs> lo 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 you didn't have to look. Look, she There's is naughty panting now. Yeah, in the flesh, it's absolutely gassed. Army. Yeah. Sent everyone round from Birmingham to do the camera. Wow, when you okay. can just sort of hold Rob and then the rest of you can do the camera. In which case, I reckon, I reckon Rob should come on commentary. Yeah, Rob, come on comms. Right, are you going off comms? Because you need to go and get ready. Right, OK, so here's Rob coming over. And here, here we are, uh, Newcastle. Asadi picks up. And he picked up on Maguire. Here's Will Payne. He can't stop it. Angus Gunn picks up the puck. So hi Rob. Hi Rambo. How nice you doing? Join us today. Yeah. Um, no. Be here the whole day tomorrow, though, of course. I am here the whole day tomorrow. Oh, lovely stuff. Lovely. And uh, there's Nick off to uh, to get ready. Holstos. Oh, well, Holstos got a new helmet this year. Shiny. It's shiny. That's Joe Gubbins, our players rep over there. Oh, ho, 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 ho. I'm glad he pulled out of that one, actually. Taylor shoots. I can hear you. I can hear you. You were doing. Here's Holstoff. Kittle's Holstoff. Kittle's Holstoff shoots. Oh, and fought away by Tom Brooks Smith. Ah, oh, this is touch screen. Yeah, it's touch screen. It's uh, very fancy. You can flick it along and see the head to heads between the two teams as well over the years. Oh, you've got the, got the line ups and everything. Yeah. yeah, Sheffield didn't put them in, but you, we do no, have no. them. Sheffield, the people's team, of course. Here's, here's Toth. Here's Toth. That's what I was talking about earlier. Oh, and Toth. That was well wide. I just want to point out. Yeah, it was well wide, but it was like you know, it was a decent wrister. You know, yeah, he's chancing his arm. Yeah, you can't you can't win the raffle if you don't buy a ticket. Offside. Oh, here we go, head to head. Head to head, six, six, two drawn, two drawn, six wins for the Wildcats, zero wins for the Bears. Yeah. Although looking at this roster, I do feel it might be a bit more even. I, I think yeah, I think it might be more even though. Toth is playing up front. Who's uh, he was someone I actually looked at and wanted for IS, but he's not here next week. Um, hung, I think he's Hungarian dual, so he can play for GBU or for um, IES. Did they invoke the uh, the Miller rule to play him in T2, I wonder? Yeah, yeah, I think so. Did you just get a static shock? Yeah. 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 Toth fires it wide. Parker. That's great news. Dave is now able to do the replays. Behind the net from Newcastle. Parker keeps it in the zone. By the way, I just said that Joe's not earned a break and I just got the dirtiest look ever. Uh, <laughs> a nice it's ball for the Dragon. Right. Is this Angus Gunn here? I think so. It says he's Angus Gunn on here. Yeah. Kittles Hall stuff. Ooh. Ho, ho, ho. Wait, these referees are quite tight on the board and in charging calls, so you've got to be. Been distinctly less physical this game than the last so far. I think both teams may be a bit more sensible. Uh, and to, well, to be fair, Birmingham were pretty, apart from that one moment of madness. Uh, we're pretty well disciplined in the last game. 
Who is the goaltender? E. Thompson. Is that Emma Thompson? E. Thompson. Edward Thompson. Edward Thompson. Edward Thompson. I, I thought there was a goalie called Emma Thompson. I have no idea where I got that idea from. But anyway. Edward Thompson. That's a, that's a weird change. No, that's Emma Bunting, Dave. Dave just asked me if Emma Thompson was a spice girl. That's offside, called by Zeller. Edward Thompson has a uh, 0.87 save percentage mm -hmm. and 4.67 goals against. And what's uh, Brooke Smith got? Well, in his career, yeah, 5.55 goals against, 0.91 save percentage. His face is Sorry, that's only this year. Darn. Yeah. yeah, it is. Oh, I wish that was career stats. Yeah. Dave, but why are the career stats not on here? Oh wait, I think I think I found it. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Excellent. Thanks, Dave. Look at his goals. He scored 45 points in 80 games. Tom Brooksmith. Of course, he does play out as well. <laughs> yeah. Here's Jordan Jordan Sul 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 Sullivan. Put my teeth back in there. Will Payne passes to Gray. Gray. That was not that was not a shot fitting of a man named Gray. Sheffield Bears have come into this game on the back of six losses. Uh -huh. Whereas Newcastle have got four wins out of the last six. Three of those against Sheffield. Yeah, it'll be B, B and well. C. Yeah. I've got the feeling that when Sheffield Bear and uh, the C's and the B's play each other, they still both turn up in the same jerseys. They turn up both in white, it's just a shambles. Edward Thompson there, nice wee stop. What's the shot count, Dave? Three one the shots in favour of Sheffield. Toth comes in to take the draw. I think Joe kind of uh, well it's four one now, but Joe kind of exaggerated in their bench. He said they only had six gears, they have seven quite clearly. Yeah, make I all mean the that difference. makes all the difference yeah. here. The seven, seven to six. No. Getting some so proud, Izzy Gordon. Oh, and Holstoff. Nice moves by Holstoff. Nice hands. Oh, and he can't get the shot off. Oh, nice of Tony Crowell. We can't, unfortunately, really subsidise air and everything. We try and encourage teams to try and do it themselves. A lot of them do it on Facebook Live. Um, just purely because of the, the travel involved and uh, equipment hire and stuff. And you know, Clubs couldn't afford to, to pay for that stuff. And um, Well, you know, we, we can try to market the game as much as possible for the players. Here's Toth. Oh, nice hands by Toth. Oh, good save. Oh, oh Jordan oh, Sullivan denied with a second stop there from Edward Thompson. Now we can see if Dave really worked out how to do the replays. Just will go. Oh, oh, well done. Good. See the disciplines higher in this game. Yeah, not as reckless. No, Will Payne just. <laughs> He's got his stick stuck in between his legs. Could speed through the zone here. Out in front. Oh, opportunity. To, oh, oh, Jones can't hold on to it. Here's Wilson. 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 I love a good Wilson. Oh, he's got the pass on. Back he goes, shot. That was a bit of a weak shot in the end. Lopin worked really hard to make the pass and then he sort of just let him down a little bit with the shot. Here's Joe Gubbins. Oh, that's a good, good smart pass by Joe Gubbins there. Here's Holstoff. Oh, Ooh, and collision. Toth brought down by Holstoff. Gubbins. Shot by Brooke Smith. Here we go. We've got a replay of that of that action a minute ago. Watch this. That's not what we were looking at, Dave, is it? Is that the last <laughs> replay? That was just what happened. <laughs> <laughs> Good job, Dave. <laughs> Good job, Dave.
We need a soundboard for this. That would be great. Uh, well, Joe should be. Joe's on his break. Get him to make one now. Yeah. Yeah. Joe's just sitting doing nothing. Ask him. <laughs> be good. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, make a soundboard up. He will actually lose the tatty if we if. <laughs> Out the zone there. <laughs> Sullivan picks up the puck. Sullivan. Oh, and that goes through everybody. Oh, hey, oh, oh, oh. Yeah, puck here we go. In. Here we go, here the go, dragon. Done. Oh, oh, good back checking by Daisy Leftley there. Luke leftly for dead, and then she got she got back in the back check there. I like names I can work with. Toth. Toth steps in. One way, other Oh, oh. Pierre Toth there. Sheffield Pierce C go 1 0 up. Good finish. Just for a change. The clock's been doing it's that been all doing day. It all, all just today. It's been doing it since this morning, yeah. Excellent. They had 100 nil up earlier on. That's pretty good. And they had 100 for 14, which is, suggests uh, too many batsmen had been. <laughs> it's hossed off. Oh, no. he almost equalised straight away. Where did that go? Took a wow. weird bounce and ended up in the net. So the face off, Peter Toth there, assisted by number 41. I think that's generous. I'm not sure 41 done anything, but. Will Payne, the will pain train. Payne. I suppose it will pain him if he doesn't get any assist today. <laughs> I'm not giving you that one. My favourite one is Will Fry. That's my favourite name in sport. Yeah? Yeah. I particularly enjoyed when I was listening in New York last week. Uh, Tiger Cross is still one of my favourite players. Oh, Tiger Cross is a great name. What a great name that is. And Rory the Butcher, was, uh, he was, he'll go down in history. There's a guy named Rory Butcher. Yeah. That we nicknamed Rory the Butcher and also shut out Hull in the first game and had to help himself up on the bar. Oh. Because he couldn't get up, like lift himself up properly, so he had to use the bar to get up. Oh, nice. Shot. Oh, oh. And the goalie there. Playing with fire is Edward Thompson. Here's Will Payne. Ooh. Shot. And that's cleared. Bon Jovi now halfway through, halfway there. Who's number 66? William Hawthorne Slater. Oh, another double barrel name. I wonder how many double barrel names we have in the BIHA. Weirdly, if you create a, a guest team sheet, it doesn't let you do double barrel names. Really? Why? No, yeah, I don't know. It crashed the system the last time I tried to do it. Here's me, Peter Toth. Peter Toth. Good skating on. Hayden Hunter's away. Bye, Hayden. But why does it work on registrations, Joe, uh, Dave? Oh, I wish I hadn't asked. <laughs> <laughs> I did ask. Oh, and Gubbins can't get a hold of that. He's after it with left lay. Pulled out, of maybe hitting there, there, which is fair enough because I think she'd have absolutely murdered them. But here comes Loughton, shot right on, saved easily by the goalie. Newcastle need to up their game a wee bit here. Left lay, oh, it's broken up. Loughton, all stops. Holstoff's nice manoeuvre. Oh, here, he here he is. Shot. Oh, good save good by save. Tom Brook Smith. I tell you what, if Tom Brook Smith is normally a skater, he's doing an alright yeah. job in goals. Yeah, yeah, that sounds right. Three shots on uh, Brook Smith so far. Credited by our eye in the sky, Dave Rogers. Yeah, he's wearing his bifocals up here. Or the very focal Dave, I'm not sure. What's the difference? Um, bifocal, or oh, bifocals, you got like double vision, I think. Something like that, yeah. 
have no idea. I've never had to wear glasses, but. Fair enough. McGrandon's got glasses because you can see two of everything. That must be good in some circumstances. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Equally as disappointed in others. Yeah. Angus Gunn. Maybe it's too standoffish, maybe, by Sheffield. Except Will Payne, he comes in. Oh, toss. It goes to Holstoff. Holstoff shoots. Oh, big block. block by Will Payne there. Jordan Sullivan going with this puck. Oh, oh nice move, nice hands there. Back inside, shot. Toth tries to make a pass in front, it's broken up. Parker. Back to Toth. Oh, nice play by Toth to win that battle. Out in front, oh. Sullivan. Oh, Sullivan. Oh. He scored a nice goal in the end. He did He did get the composure to finish it in the end because he looked like he'd absolutely murdered it, like butchered it completely. Look at this. Comes back across from Toth. Fans on it. Beats the goalie and has enough to just bury that one at home against Edward Thompson there. And it's looking like the Bears see... Where did you put these in the rankings? Bears C. I think Bears C were eighth. Eighth. Yep. That was that was much better, uh, Dave. But the goal replay is easier, is my understanding. So. Still six minutes left in this game. Yep. Gun. Thing is, the longer the game goes, the harder it is for Newcastle. Yeah. With their seven, not six skaters. Seven. Yeah. No seven play They need to. Be Use those extra players to their uh, their advantage. Holstoff comes back for it rather gingerly, looking a bit kind of like he wished it was icing just to save him. But I try and think about it. Angus Gunn just chips it in. Daisy Leftley in after it. Leftley fires it round. Wilson. Gubbins does well there. Keep that in. Holds his own. That's rimmed. Jason Taylor. Taylor. Hmm? Jason Taylor going back after the put there. Jason Taylor. Okay. Starting to learn more names here. Yeah. Yeah. It is Angus Gunn, isn't it? It is Angus Gunn, It's Angus not like Gunn, yeah, yeah. some random word that's when yeah, no, it's just... Oh, it's, it's, with a shot right on. It is the dragon. And interestingly, uh, well, or not interestingly, just because we need something to talk about, you guys have no one, no one with a single digit number. Yeah, I mean, there's only seven of them, so it's not like there's loads of numbers, but Gubbins in the face-off draw against Toth here, and Gubbins, to be honest, looked like he had turned his Xbox on pause, or thought he had, and it wasn't on pause. Shot. Ooh, oh, Gubbins tips that one over the bar. Play, here's Toth. Toth. Steps in, one way, oh nice hands by Toth. Steps inside, shot That's right safe. on again. Here's Daisy Leftley. Sits it to Toth. Oh, and that's broken up, here's Walker. Walker shoots. Good save by Tom Brooks-Smith. What's the shots now? What's the shots on, uh, on not 12-5 to shot on... 12-5 to Sheffield in shots. 2-0 on the scoreboard, which is what really matters in uh, games like this. You throw the form book out for this one. That's off the glass. It's, it's nice and clean. I think they maybe watched the last game um, from in the, the glass cage of emotion and, uh, and saw the, some of the calls that were being made and, and tightened up. 
no. I mean, sometimes make it. They sometimes make a lot of fun to watch, but he's hostile. Shoots. Oh, oh big okay. save by Tom Harden, Brook Smith, something or another. <laughs> that uh, guy. That guy. <laughs> number one. What's, what, what, what has anyone seen? Any? No one's seen anything. No, about. Tony's saying he'll keep his basically keep his ear out for any games at the start of the season he can watch. Yeah, that's, well, that's nice. nice to hear. Yeah. It's a nice idea taking the show on the road. It would be. It would be. It's, just, it's just not that feasible. Oh, nice move by Will Payne. And everybody kind of falls over there. Ooh. And Kiddo's whole stuff goes back. He's got Taylor across from him. Taylor picks it up. Taylor down wide to Young. Uh, young Gun. Young Gun. Young Gun. He's not that young anymore, though. Mm. Top Gun. Ooh. Play along the boards there. And here's Will Payne. Will Payne. Has it round. Wilson. Wilson gets it out. He had Hawthorne something or another there and he didn't get the pass off. Parker can't stop Gunn. Gunn's quietly having a good game, he's just not had any points or anything to show for it. Just not much end product. Yeah, and here's Toth. Toth using that really good skating. He's around the last oh. one, he's got Sullivan there. Sullivan on the backhand. Sullivan, nice hands. Oh! When in doubt, lie down. Gray. Sullivan. Oh, oh, oh good well stop played. there by Edward Thompson. Less than two minutes to play. Tier two, obviously not as uh, as popular as uh, as uh, tier tier three, where people are maybe just people don't like other people getting crunchy one cheat. You mean in terms to be of fair, this this game's not been that violent. No, uh, I think the first game set us up for a I don't know I guess physicality. Yeah. yeah. And people do tune in for their mates and stuff, and unless you're Birmingham, you don't have a lot of mates, so. <laughs> Though the live stream topped out 130 last week, we're going to take good. tier five. How many Steel teams first game. That? What? Ooh, and that hits the post. There was uh, 30 teams here last week, 10 in each tier. Is there any way of knowing where people are tuning in from? Uh, I think there is a way. I think you can at the end. Yeah. It's going to be interesting to see if you get more international oh, people watching. I'm not sure one. about that one. Zeller on the money though. Goals offside. Have we got another shot count, Dave? 14 6 is the shots. Is that one? Is that what this is coming to, right there? Yeah. Here's Holstoff. Holstoff. Oh, Holstoff. Holstoff shoots. Good save by Brooksmith. Sheffield is just holding that high defensive line quite well. Yeah. They're getting absolutely nothing in the high scoring areas. Oh, kicks it down in the corner, and Taylor comes across for it. He rims it. Speed girl on our team that chuckled every time I said he needed to rim it. Gubbins. And there we have it, 2-0 at the Sheffield um, C team. Is this a Sheffield B team that's going Sheffield out now? B team now. Oh, standing up and having a stretch. Is Nick's hoodie still there? No, I've moved it. <laughs> I didn't realise it was there. Next game, is and that the what I do? <laughs> oh dear. So next up we have Imperial versus Sheffield B. Imperial. Pardon? So tiny. You need to you need to do camera. If you need to go, um, Amy will maybe do it. Yeah, just say to Amy to do it. Oh, sorry, oh, one of us will do it. Is, is Joe losing his break time? 
Oh. And Joe will have to do oh, it. Oh, no. Yeah, thank you for coming and helping. Thank you very much for your help. Where is where where Amy going? I've never been mean to Amy all day. I've been mean to plenty of other people, but not Amy. Oh, yeah, because... for this game is that we've it's got just, uh, it's just a real because I'm the sorting camera. my nuts as well at the same time <laughs> <laughs> uh, Rambo you need to know when to press the button <laughs> and this game has begun so Rambo how, you feeling ready to you ready yet to start talking <laughs> well I think Rambo's having a bit of a laughing fit over here unfortunately <laughs> Dave you do not want to know what's been going on Oh, sorry, folks. <laughs> no, but Tilly! Oh, good save there. <laughs> you didn't, you had your earplugs in. He's talking about my snoring. Well, in all competitions, Here's Imperial Badass. and Sheffield Bears B have played each other twice. And they have won one each. Mind you, the last time Imperial beat Sheffield B. Oh, Sam Jackson! 1 0. Sam Jackson there, what a shot. Look at that quick wrist release there. Don't you be trying to poach him for ball hockey with shots like that. Boom. <laughs> Is that Nathaniel Bell that's in goals for Sheffield Bears? It is I Nathaniel it Bell. Is. I'm, I'm starting. Jesse Cross tries to get through there. It is Jesse Cross, isn't it? Number 23. Jesse Cross, congratulations. I'm starting to recognise players now from last year. Oh, well, nice move. Either a good thing or just you've been doing it too long. <laughs> <laughs> Now, we announced... Sorry? We should have... Uh, we've got a couple of... At least one GBU uh, call-up for the IAS series in Alison Brain in this team. I think Charlotte O'Brien is on the... Uh, she's Yes, yeah, she's playing D for the, the Sheffield Bears B as well. Number 63, I believe. Yeah, Charlotte O'Brien, the captain as well of this Bears B team. The Bears have only got four players in this. Do they have a penalty? Yeah, there was an. I think it was interference. Yeah, well, it's Missed on the clock that. now. Yeah. Ooh, and that's tipped away. Oh, right. nice hands there. Oh, beautiful. Steps in. No one there though. Oh, it is Andreas Sigaris. Andreas Sigaris, named earlier on as the uh, GB, uh, one of the GBU players, is playing in Tier 2 here. Andreas Sigaris scored a goal in Russia as well. Nice pass to Sam Jackson. Oh, and that's been, oh that was completely unnecessary. Even if, he, even if the puck was there, why did you cross-check him? I think you hurt your you hurt Charlotte O'Brien more than you hurt the player, but that was just silly. Peter King there. Being a silly, silly boy. Oh, Sheffield Bear not quite as disciplined as uh, their bees, not quite as disciplined perhaps. 2-0 though. Imperial score. Tell you what, this shows that Imperial were not a one-man uh, wrecking crew. No. Very true. Is Trent Allen playing for them? 
I think I saw his name on the list. Uh, yeah, well. he's at the bottom, really. Yeah, and it was yeah, seven, he trained a couple of times two. with the Steel Queens this year. He's like to come on now. Oh, really? Yeah. I think he trained in Coke Bridge as well. Fair enough. From what I've seen so far, pretty one-sided this game. At the moment, yeah, certainly. Bears be yet to find their rhythm. Maybe not quite benefit as much from call-ups as the uh, the A team are. As the C team C are. Sorry. C team, yeah. A team. Maybe the B team have been have kept the nucleus and then the yeah. uh, A teamers that have been reassigned have been assigned to the C team. Be interesting to see what A team turns up next week. It could be Bagley. Arson Brain. Oh, she falls. That play almost worked out for them though. Yao. He's up the wall. King steps back. Green fires it in the middle. Beaumont. Beaumont through the zone. Beaumont. Pooh! <laughs> he bounced off him there. Here's Sagaris. Sagaris off the wall. Sagaris, won, the one wearing the Zimmerman jersey. Uh, which works out well for him because he uh, plays number 13, I believe, for GB. We're inferior meant to be changing everybody to that new jersey. Uh, I think they tried and then they didn't do it. I prefer the new jersey. Well, the think. brown one. Yeah. Do, don't keep going backwards, Shatori. <laughs> 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 Just wheel at his own net. He's lost it. I was in his blocker. Shiotani, sorry, Shiotani. Shiotani. Shoo Shiotani. Not a bad record this year. 0.86% save percentage. 4.98 against. Okay. It's number 59 for Imperial. He's got a solid four check about him. Sam Jackson playing D in this team. Looks yeah. like it. Boutelier. Right, okay. Did you manage to get a message to the penalty box as to what time it's? Ah. Okay, it's just confusing me now. Yeah. Killick. Short side goes wide. Yeah. Here's Boutelier. Angel. Oh, Angel loses it. Comes the other way is Jazwal. Taylor the tape will tell you that Imperial have won the Division 2 check in playoff. Oh, nice pass. Boutillier. Boutillier lays it off. Angel. Shot. Oh, and Sigaris can't get on. Oh. Broken up there. On the way it comes. Martin goes for it. Dow. Sigaris. Sigaris. Kalikov. Sam Jackson. Oh. oh, good stop by Nathaniel Bell there. Could go anywhere that one. Big mad mental Nathaniel there. We could save. Kalikov directing traffic there. This is the biggest bench I think Imperial have ever had for Nationals. In terms of numbers, certainly for a long, long time. Kalikov. See. Yeah, they're usually one of the lighter squads. Well, not when they've got Big Ben Leakey playing, but. Cox. Yeah. They have a bit of time here. Here's Yao. Yep. Oh, and Unwin comes in, try and lower the boom. And Trent Allen steps over the line. Trent Allen across to Boutelier. Oh, and that goes wide. And here's Andreas Sigaris. Sigaris fires it into the corner. Boutelier. 
Boutelli finds, oh, he almost found Sigaris, but broken up. As you can tell, Sigaris, um, Sigaris wearing his, uh, his Streatham Red Hawks gear. Is he actually called Angel number 59? Um, no, it's John Graham. John Graham. <laughs> Too many. Oh, oh, and that's a penalty. That was a slow change. That was, it was probably more on the changers than the than the, the changees, if you will. Let's be honest, that makes absolutely no sense. How did the uh, Phoenix go on today? Uh, they won one and lost one. They lost 3-1 to the Air Jets and won 3-1 to the Borland Kilts. We got more which games is tomorrow. a terrible name for a hockey team. Yeah, where are they? F they say that's a stupid it's name. It's a name, like it's a sort of area in Kirkcaldy. Right. Here's King. Oh, oh, and that, oh, and there's a lot of Mask of Zorro stuff doing down there. On guard. Not to be confused with Zorro got the bet. Was that the uh, was that the surname you got told off for on the live stream before? Yeah, I've already been told off for that one. Yeah, Here's that. Sam Jackson. He's skating like a mother skater through the zone. <laughs> oh, offside and a bump for his troubles. Looks a bit perplexed about that. It's off one by Sheffield. Here's the legendly the legend of Bagley Vance. Look, it's late at night, Rob. You can roll your arm eyes at me all you want, but I've got to I love the most bare cheese show. Beautiful shot, Steve K. You can keep Trent for the Steel Queens. <laughs> no. <laughs> On win. Barris. Yow. Oh, thump by Unwin. It's a bit late that. It was a bit of a late hit. Have you seen the new late hit um, thing? No. It's the two fists together, is which it, is, is, it, is, is it, fantastic because you've got a whistle on your knuckle. Oh, so <laughs> 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 it's a new one to add to the yeah. dance, Joe. Yeah, the old, uh, the old double fist there. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Sam plays D for Haringey Husky. He'll know Ryan. He'll know Ryan McFarlane then. He's going to play for GBU oh, next Oh, here we week. go. To twos. Oh, nice ball to Jesse Cross. Jesse Cross. Does he finish it? Oh. The now, there's two Jesse Crosses in British hockey. There's Jesse Cross of this team and Jesse Cross of the Sheffield Steel Dogs. I learned that last week. And Jesse Cross of the Steel Dogs is huge. 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 So you can tell them apart quite easily. Here's Boothilly. Boothilly. Oh! Who was well, that? That was offside. Roy Hamilton. That's, well, fair enough. There's a penalty, but that was. <laughs> that was really offside. Did even Yuri Schusters would have called that one? For those who don't know, Yuri is up in the, in the gantry, so it's a bit of banter. Yeah, a bit of Bit of banter. Bit of banter. It's a 20 to 10 banter. Yeah, 20 to 10 banter. Post watershed. Pre Good. pre bedtime for a normal BIH stud like myself. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
Andre Sagaris. Oh, what wheels this boy's got. Andre Sagaris. He's got Dow at the top, and here's Sagaris. Patience, shoots. Oh, and that, he tries to find the corner. I love watching these these really good players load up a wrist shot like that, though. Our Jesse has better flow, though. And here comes Andre Sigaris. If you if you want to go through, through the the pod archives, there's a really good interview with Jesse Cross actually. It was one of my first interviews. Yeah, in I pod. think I remember that when I used to listen to the pod. You should listen to it more. I should do. To be fair, we don't do as many as we did last year. Largely because Dave's got like doctorates and stuff, and he's starting yeah. to be a bit kind of like selfish with everything, you know. Dave. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's pressing the wrong button. He's probably talking <laughs> to the rest. I don't know who he's talking to. <laughs> he's talking to us. He's telling the rest to shut up. There's a lot of Imperial people watching. Yeah, we're up to 47 people in total now. Here's Sigaris, come on, this is a surely it. Oh, I thought it would have been his first BHA goal. I'm not sure if he's scored in BHA competition before. Do you know what? I Ooh. can tell you that information. Well, Elite Prospects doesn't have me in it, despite the fact they said everybody's in it. No, no, they're not, no, because they said it was what, 08 09 season? Yeah, but I played in 08 09 season. I don't think you did. I did? I don't think you did. I'm sure I did. I, my final season was 06 07. Yeah, but I had. Um, I done my diploma and finished in 2009, so I'm sure I played. All those stats are from the time when I used to manually collate the stats anyway. Yeah. I did it. I don't, are you on it? I'll, I'll have a look on my phone. Yeah, my stats are a bit fuzzy. I should have a Steel Queen, a stat for a Steel Queen, so. It's got the first ever game winning goal for a Steel Queen. Yo! Oh, right on then. Oh, Trent Allen getting a bit of a bash in there, and uh, that's something that we can all enjoy and get behind. <laughs> Past rosters, here we go. Oh, Lynn. 0506. Why did Lynn retract the message? You're there. <laughs> now, how's Joe there? And I'm not there. I wonder if I'm there then, because that far back. No better stats than Joe. <laughs> O'Brien plays it out. So it might actually check, tell man. us who's the all-time leading goal scorer. I suppose. I'm pretty sure it's like um, Dan Steele. Dan Steele, yeah. Has to be surely. Yeah. I know that um, Chase McCarthy got to 100 points, but I don't think he's played enough games. And I don't think, I, I'm not even sure Tony Sellers has played enough, like, enough games. And he no, certainly, yeah. all these games have been at tier, at tier one level. Yeah. He could score goals. He's played a couple of games in, in goals for the Beagles it's and about, stuff. It's about levels without being harsh. Yeah. <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh, and we're going the other way now. Runcorn, and Butilli decides to play Runcorn offside. I wonder which players play for the most different clubs. Uh, we've got one. We, we've got one that's played three. Who? Laura Wells. Four teams. I, is, is Tunga moving at the air? No, that was April Fools. No, oh, was it? Yeah. I only saw it in passing. Tunga will be at Edinburgh, uh, Edinburgh for Eagle Edinburgh. for like. Forever, yeah. Eight, eight. Dow. Ooh. Hard man, you, Joe. Yeah. <laughs> Two nil still to the Imperial Devils. Do you know Devils are playing a smart game? Oh, what oh. hands! I hope we got a highlight of that, but Joe's not in the gorilla position, so there's every chance we missed it. Back to Cigar. Oh, Cigaris backhand. Ooh. <laughs> Now, well, Joe, um, sorry, Dave, getting his, his his fingers in many pies today. Shot! Oh, and that's a brave block by King there. 
Tell you what pie I did enjoy today, that shepherd's pie. Shepherd's pie was good, I didn't have any of the dessert though. No. It just seemed like a bread-based dessert with some custard. I'm not really a dessert type of guy. I... No, no. Take, take, take yeah. us with our no, I had a roasty for just coming back up the stairs with. Like, is <laughs> like a, is an apple. A, a road roasty. Um, <laughs> They've got England under 19 seconds. <laughs> Dave looks confused. <laughs> yeah, this will be one of these ones where they put the wrong Dave Rogers on the on the stats. <laughs> I thought you meant for the national oh. B team. I was like, that's never happening. How many points did he get? Oh, and Trent. <laughs> <laughs> Trent Allen. <laughs> Yo. Oh, oh and we've got an odd man. But Jesse Cross with a good back check here. Unwin. Oh, right in the coupon. I've done right in the coupon already today. To be honest, Noggin. Noggin's a good one. I've not done Noggin today. I've like done Noggin. I've done Puss, I've done Mincer, and now I've done I've done right in the coupon twice. Noggin. Sorry, everyone. Wonder what other like. Uh, yeah. Find out synonyms for head. In the Nashers, I like that one. What's it? Uh, is it? There's bound to be co uh, Cockney Raymond slam for head, is there not? Right in the cranium. Cranium, that's a good one. What's Cockney Raining Slam for head? Have we got we got something? Find something. Otis Redding is Cockney Slimy. It reminds me slam for head in. <laughs> <laughs> right in the Otis Redding. <laughs> right in the Otis Redding. <laughs> loaf of bread. Oh, I like that one. Right in the loaf. When you just say right in the loaf. loaf. Yeah, right, yeah, okay, yeah. that's the next one. That's the next one, right in the loaf. Right, okay. I think people like when we go on a tangent. I think it's okay. Jackson. I don't find anyone. Dow. Into the last 20, I think. 20, uh, we're having a bit of a spaz. 124 yeah. nil on the current score. Current scoreboard. To be honest, if that scoreboard was flashing up there, it would keep people highly entertained. Or with the amount of flashing it's doing, give someone a fit. <laughs> Andre Sigaris plays it lovely there to uh, the man who I've forgotten the name of. Andre Sigaris! Oh! John Graham. John Graham. That's who it is. John Graham. I wonder if he's in relation to Alex Graham. Highly unlikely. Do you know who Alex Graham is? Yeah. <laughs> But they're both huge. <laughs> Might be something in the water. Uh, well, the game's finished 2-0. I'll tell you what, I miss Amy Robinson today because she she was good with the coffees and teas. Oh. Yeah, so I think we're going to have a nice cut. So Nick, uh, Nick and I, Rob and I, Rob will and take I, a, bre yeah. a, break, a brief break. I think Rob's a Lancashire man as well, which makes the pronunciation different. So what, break? Yeah. Yeah. What's a break? What's break Cockney Raymond slang for break? Do you want me to look it up? Yeah, let's look <laughs> it up before we have our break. Veronica Lake. We're gonna the, have a, we're we're gonna have a let's go have a Veronica Lake.
Showing so much yeah. that we were like we went on a night out with the people from our gym. Yeah. We, like, we, so much. we probably only about we were only seeing the night before. And then we saw my brother and uh, me, uh, sister in law. We went to that night out. Like, yeah, we didn't tell anyone. But we were like, yeah, and, it might um, <laughs> um, and they were like, yeah. Welcome back, everyone. I think Rambo's here with me. He is. Excellent mm. news. I was just fin finishing that mouthful of caramel shot cake. Was it good? It was nice. Was it uh, Mrs. Ivel special? Yeah. Speaking of Ivels, we've got one on the ice right now. Nicholas Nick Ivel on the ice. Also known as the Super King. Yep. He was there in the Flames days. Right, yeah, in the right at the death of the Flames. Yeah. <laughs> Came in and the killed Frenchman. the flames. P E R R I E. I think it was just a typo because I was tired. The Frenchman, Adam mm. Perry. Perrier. <laughs> Adam Perrier. He's from Yorkshire. <laughs> Is he not proper like Jordy though, or something? Something like that. Yeah. Is there such a thing? Yeah. I like the way Dave's put the penalty up on the wrong side. Ah, oh, Dave. Good job, Dave. Apparently, Lynn Sinclair is still with us. Shout out to everyone listening, 34 of you. Excellent. 
Ball, hey, oh, oh, the first oh, oh, ball. Oh. Replay. Have we got no. Oh, come on, Dave, replay. Oh. Oh, we're still in the third period, according to the uh, scoreboard. <laughs> see what's going on in this game. Old man Gus Zimmerman's up here. He surely can't complain after that performance his team just put on. Mean not I didn't realise Andreas Sigaris was playing for you this weekend. I, Andrea, Andreas, I didn't realise he was playing. Oh, Rambo, the stats are broke. Yeah, just um, like retyping stats admin. Yeah. And then just log in as yourself and I'll show you how. Don't mean out the password, all right. Adam Perry here, previously announced in the GBU men's squad for next week's game. Oh, Lawson Glassby. Yeah. Cool. We've got management. Management. Click it again. Management. And then manage schedule. Manage schedule. And that's champs two. That champs two. And then you click the little blue, oh, blue eye. eye. Yeah, how, how is he out? What happened then? What, what, what's going on here? Oh. oh no, he came on through the middle door. That two minute <laughs> penalty through the wrong door. Penalty is that Coburn? I think. I think it's Coburn. Yeah. Oh, there we go. All loaded. Adam Perry. Oh, and they try the Hail Mary and it doesn't quite work. And Nick Ivel can't get a hold of it. Yeah. <laughs> Off the wall, Perry. Perry, two on one here with Lawson Glassby. Shoots himself. Oh, and he almost beats some short side. You can see what he was trying to do there. I can. I can see what he's trying to do. Remind me of a young me. A much younger you. Oh, a much, much younger me. When you used to play in goal and were at the wrong end. Yeah. <laughs> the goalie save, I mean. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. my mistake. Nick Ivo there. Picks it, tries to kick it forward. King's only got eight, eight man bench in total. Well, the Kings have only ever lost one game to Nottingham Mavericks B in all time. Is that this space. year? 6 1 and 11 12 Nats. 11 12 Nats. And they've won seven. I wonder if that goes back to the, the Flames days on the stats there. When did they change? I can't remember. I think they've been the Kings for a lot longer than the, the Lions, the Birmingham Lions have been the Birmingham Lions. Yeah, they have. Yeah. Because, the, like, I'm sure up the top in our, our pop-ups, we've got the Kings logo, but we don't have the Lions. We have the we Eagles, have the, the Eagles logo. Eagles one. Fairness, we still have Huddersfield up there. And Bristol. And Bristol. Oh, who's this number 65 character? For? Uh, from Northampton. Adam Perry with another shot Stephen there. Brown. Stephen Brown. He is, he is a physical. That sounds correct. Dave. Here's David Astle of the referee and, and Norton and Mavericks fame also boyfriend um, and punching um, with Essie Etasawa. Oh, no, no, there you go. Thanks for a little bit of information there, Randall. I found out though, um, Dave, we've, we've been like slagging Dave off a while because he has he keeps wearing his hair in the bun. He's sort of top knot thing. Right. And uh, like, you know, a little bit of a laugh, but he told me he's actually grown it long so um, it can be cut off and used for people who can't grow hair. Oh, that's, that's, that's I think that's very noble yeah, of him actually. Yeah, quite a nice little... <laughs> Good play. Flicked out. Christian Robinson after it. Christian Robinson, good speed. Oh, <laughs> I thought he was going to kill the, the Nottingham goalie there. I thought he was absolutely going to wipe him out. What's that guy's name? Which guy? This guy here, 45. 45. It is <laughs> not on the roster. Oh, for goodness. Oh, no, he is. Look, well, oh, yeah, Duck Jake Field. Duffenfield. 2012-2013 was the season that the Flames became the Kings. Hmm. It was only one what? season before the Is Eagles this on their Wikipedia Lions. page? It's on our Wikipedia page. Oh, all right, cool. It also says 2009-2010 season was the first season that Old School played for his actual university and didn't play for Imperial. Who's that? Old School. Vince Miller. Is it? Yeah. How do you not remember Vince Miller? Old School. Is he? 
He's, he? for, he's playing for the Kent. Oh, I must have, I must have missed that earlier when I was still yeah. in Mallorca. Oh, I missed that. Yeah. Oh. I don't know. I, I bet his really elite prospect stats are amazing. Old schools. Does Steel Queen sort of have a Wikipedia page? Why? <laughs> we'll have to make one. Perry. And he needs spinorama. Comes in the corner, realises it's Nick and probably is hating himself right now. Now finish my caramel shot kick and invest fully in the game now. He's lost in Glassby. Nice pass to Perry. Broken up by Aston. He's lost in Glassby. Rims it. Ow. Nick keeps getting static shots. Nick does. Yeah. Yeah, good That's well, why he's not that's why his hockey playing so good. <laughs> uh, no, sorry, <laughs> Rob does. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> Brimpins in the corner. Here's Adam Perry. Perry finds Glassby. Glassby shoots. Oh, that. I actually think that was lucky. It was top, uh, touched by T. Juice there. Uh, yeah, they've got two players that play for Whitley. Lawson Glassby. In fact, I think. No, I don't think Niall Simpson's playing, but they've got Lawson Glassby and uh, Nick Ivor. I mean, um, Adam Perry. <laughs> Nick Ivor. <laughs> oh, I shouldn't laugh. Yes, McKinnon, I have finally turned up. Thanks for uh, asking. Yeah. It's been a standing joke with McKinnon. Not a back checking joke, because he doesn't do that, but. <laughs> oh, Haynes. That was good. On the money there from Alice. Oh, oh David no. Astle, a little too casual. And here's Adam Perry. David Astle, good work there behind the net. I've, uh, I've refereed the game with Aston. Yeah, it's my liney, and uh, I would, I would not um, be opposed to doing it again. Well, that's I think he's a very good, uh, competent young official. Well, that's what we like to hear. Or win. Swing and a miss. They like this play down the middle enough for me, don't they? <laughs> Adam Perry we had Cowburn. I'm not sure if Cowburn played for the, war for the Warriors at any point. Glassby did for a while. Oh, oh. Christian Johnson, Cowburn. Up to Glassby. Feels like a goal's coming. Yeah. Oh, that's high sticks. Perry. Kings they just need to start moving it around a bit more fluidly. Yeah. Yeah. They need to take their time. Yeah, it's almost had like a force in it too much. Yeah. And when the time is right, they'll know. Contagious. Ooh, and that shot. I hope that shot is not contagious because it weren't great. I liked that one actually. That's quite that good. That's good. That I like that yeah. one. Is it pronounced contagious or is it like contagious? Like. Yeah. Jesus, but with a T. Yeah, I wonder, I wonder. Oh, nice hands from, Ooh. I think it's Murphy. Duck in field. I don't watch her, you see that one. Guess that's why we've not been brought beers up tonight. <laughs> and here comes Asto on the rush. Nice move to go around Ivo. Good skating from Asto. Oh, nice move inside. 
Well, Astle has a bit of words for Tejas. Oh, is that a tripping penalty? Uh, on, I think so. Maybe we'll get them both. Get the, the trip. I called a trip and a dive the other week there. Can <laughs> two offset minors. It was it was quite funny. Trip in for number seventy-five. Seventy-five. George Murphy of the University of Derby. 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 That was quite Yorkshire. They, even Joe looked at me if it was. I know, but my, my pronunciation <laughs> of Derby, I didn't say it was Darby in Yorkshire. Darby. Yeah, Derby's a Derbyshire Rambo. Yeah. Glad we cleared that one up. Yeah. The, the question last week, oh, oh there it is, there Adam it is. Perry, I don't think he meant that. The Frenchman. Adam Perrier. Adam Perrier. Shoots. Oh. Damn. Goal number one for Z, so not on me are flames. I think the flames anymore, they're the kings. Oh. The kings of the kings. The kings of Northumbria. Glassby across to Stephen Brown. Stephen Brown tries to find Tejas but doesn't. Dowd's well, fires it in. Dowd's well that ends well perhaps. Puck in front. Oh, and that's knocked off by the house that Brooks built. No, he doesn't know where it is, though, does he? No, he doesn't. No idea. Yeah, don't pull the net on if you don't know where the puck is. Just keep it off. People need to learn to cheat better. <laughs> it's actually frustrating how bad people are at cheating. <laughs> and Northumbria with BIHA committee member and events organiser Nick Ival on the bench have successfully managed to go on the wrong bench. <laughs> Shot goes wide. Glatt Glassby looks to pick it up, but doesn't, doesn't get, get it. Handle on it did he? Yeah. I wonder where Glassby got these green short covers from. Kind of like well, it. Maybe, I think maybe in his time in Canada, he was playing a bit of college hockey over there. It looks kind of like when you look at him, maybe 1990s New Jersey Devils look about him. Yeah. He's um, he's got a uh, like an interesting look about him. Actually, he's quite a good skater though. Yeah, those are definitely college pants. Yeah. No. Oh, a nice move there by Nottingham. It's got a lethargic feel to this, this game now. Here's Glassby, steps in, takes a shot right on. Thornton just pushes that one to the side. Thornton, I think, has been here all day with the various Nottingham teams. Glassby. He's over. Here's Adam Perrier. <laughs> oh. I so didn't mean to spell his name wrong. <laughs> oh, well, you're not going to live it down, bro. Yeah. Astle in the corner. Nice reverse by Astle, but Cowburn reads it well. Unfortunately, Astle made the right move there to sort of break out plan that Dibs would drop, but hmm. nobody else was thinking about it. Did you know that... Uh, Down well. Nick Ival isn't the only player on this Kings team who also played for the Flames. Is he? I he's thought maybe Adam one. Perry had played for the Kings at one no, point. No, you might not have said he wasn't, wasn't the only one. The Perrier has. The Frenchman. <laughs> the Frenchman. No, Stephen Brown did. Did he? Stephen Brown played in the 08 09 season. Was that your final season, Rambo? And you're not on the roster for it? Yeah. Fairness, I didn't have any stats that season anyway. In fact, I played 2010 with the Eagles. Yeah? Yeah. Were you eligible? Yeah, it was no, it was my alumni year. It was my second alumni year. Second alumni uh, year. The the Rambo rule was in effect. Pop dumped in Nick Ivo. That's a good pass across to Adam Perry. Here. <laughs> in fact, I played in Nationals. I might be on here. I played in Nationals after 2008-2009. Ooh. Yeah. See if all you guys are on there and I'm not on it, I'm going to be raging. I'm going to find out Dave. Ah, oh, yes. I'm on Elite Prospects. 
There I am. Oh, that's shocking. <laughs> I'm, I'm, yes. I, I better be on Elite I've Prospects now. This is this is upsetting. Ah, see, we've got my place of birth wrong. Sure, that's not why I was born. Yeah, but uh, see, I'm on. I think they've got me and some other guy in Elite Prospects. Is like, is the same guy. Hey, look. Because I'm sure they've got me playing for like game. Whitley Bay or something in this. Like the Warriors back in like 1995. I don't even have, I don't even have like a, I don't have any stats. I just got one game. Nick Ivel plays it across here's Christian Robinson. Robinson. Ooh, and that was he bumped off the puck there. I think the Skins team are struggling largely because of the shortened bench. See, they've got a Richard Gray, uh, who's English, yeah. right? And I'm pretty sure he's down as Caledonia Steel Queens. I am not English! <laughs> <laughs> yes! Look at this nation, England! <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, poor Rambo. Look, it's got me playing for Grimsby Dynamos, <laughs> Grimsby Blackhawks, Nottingham Lions. Hey, England under 16s. Edinburgh Eagles won oh, game yeah. in 09 10. That's Nationals, that's like similar to my one. Yeah. And then a loan to the Caledonia Steel <laughs> Queens <laughs> in 17 18. How old am I according to this? Forward D, well, that's correct, because I'm a utility guy. Where in England were you born? Scotland. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm not happy with Elite Prospects, I'll be having words with them. <laughs> Strongly worded letter. Like like someone writing to points of view. Dear Elite Prospects, I was horrified to read. I just made myself sound English. You did it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Adam Perry there. Beats the off trade trap. Perry, eh? Adam Perry, eh? Please don't do that. The Frenchman dumps the puck. <laughs> got to, all Take got a to, knee. All I've got to do is bend the knee. Which actually is quite hard for me because my knees are pretty, like, sort of tatty. And <laughs> I'm actually raging at that. Here's Dowdswell. Dowdswell plays himself... <laughs> Passes to someone who's fallen over already. <laughs> Speaking of bending the knee. Oh! <laughs> uh, oh, oh! And there we go. This is getting uh, feisty. Glassby. Somebody hit somebody else for a laugh. Go on. Oh, that was a chance for a big, a big collision there. But actually, it's probably as well it wasn't a collision because I think somebody would have been seriously hurt. Super Kings back on. Nick Avalos on. Is he Super Kings? Yeah. His uh, his four check right now is about as good as Andrew, Annie McKinnon's back check. I suppose the back check is more important. Playing a zonal type of defence. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Shot. Nick Ivo goes over. Is he going to crunch this man? Can't really tell what's going on with the score. He just said 104 to nil. <laughs> so, 104 for nit for not. Batsmen have been good today. Oh, the Frenchman. Shot. Ooh, Ooh, wide. Is there a big hockey culture in the United Kingdom? There is quite a big hockey culture. Like hockey, it's kind of a family though. Yeah. Yeah, I'd agree with that. Yeah. Yeah, tight tight knee. That's a good. That's a good shout, that Dave. Like we, you know, most people that play hockey. Oh, oh good save! It's almost like a cult. Well, it's kind of one of these. You know, it's a, it's a conversation start, like an icebreaker. It's like talking about hockey is like being as big as a polar bear. It's, it's big enough to break the ice. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 not that, not that other type of hockey. 
definitely yeah. clarify it's not ball hockey anyway. Yeah, no, it's not ball <laughs> hockey. Adam Perrier, Adam Perrier. Can you say a big hi to Keisha staying up after a bedtime spot at the Kings and her uncle, Adam Perrier? Yeah. I'll say hello, Keisha. Your, your uncle is playing very well. He scored the first goal here. And uh, a new. It's a Saturday oh, night, so you're, you're all right being up after your bedtime, I believe. Yeah. The kids are not on holidays at the it's moment. It's half term, yeah. Well, my school's on half term at the moment. I like the way that they're going on, they're going back to school before Easter in Scotland and then having Easter weekend off. That's pretty good. <laughs> we go back on the. Oh, after sorry. Easter Monday. My old school is still in school until the end of next week. You're Stevie Brown. That was quite Scottish calling Stevie the veteran, if he's been around since uh, veteran. Here's Dowdswell. Dowdswell. Oh, and that misses everybody. 59 seconds on the clock. Oh, here we go. Here oh, comes the Frenchman. Here's Adam Perrier. Shot. Big Ooh. save. He's had plenty of shots, but he's not. He's only had the one goal to show for it. And the other way they come, Dodds. Dodswell, Dodswell. again. Adam Uncle Perry. Adam. Uncle Adam. Oh, oh. And Cowburn lifts the leg at the wrong time there. Oh. Niall Simpson is playing actually, by the looks of things. Yeah, so there's two. There's at least two on there, but I don't know what number Niall Simpson's meant to be. Oh, yeah, there's, but there's, yeah. they've put eleven, they've put ten players on here, and there's clearly not ten players. Oh, they've mugged off the stats, haven't they? Yeah. Just trying to pad his number of games played on elite prospects, unlike the English Richard Gray. <laughs> I'm about to tweet him back and say, "No, you've not. You've got me as English and having and ha and having played for Grimsby." You'd know if you played in Grimsby for that length of time. One more, so the last chance for Nottingham there. Eight seconds left. Uh, no. And that's the end of the game. And that ends the Northumbria A Nottingham B game with one goal. The Frenchman, Adam Perrier, scoring the only goal of the game. Yeah. Up next, it looks like we've got Newcastle again and Birmingham again. I, don't you think that that Birmingham kit looks like a German national kit? Ah, yeah. If the Germans were, yeah, I suppose. Yeah. Like the white one looks more like it. The white one looks a bit more like it. Yeah. Except the Germans are too efficient to have that weird cream one. Yeah. Like, like Germans are just too efficient for that. Every jersey would be the same colour. Exactly. Have the yeah. right names and numbers on them. And not have a lion on the front. I don't think the Germans... Uh, After this game. I don't know. So, Keisha, that's your uncle played today. I don't know if he's he got another game. I think he does have another game, isn't he? Check my TV schedule. Yeah, he's got another game today at 23.45. I believe. Yeah, I've got... Gus and Andreas on after the next cut. There's this game. Sheffield Bears seeing leads and then a cut when you're meant to be interviewing. Camera. 
Oh. We didn't miss anything on the camera there. There's no wasted movement with Joe Staten. <laughs> yeah, don't get used to it. Hard oh, four check there from Birmingham behind the net. Yeah. Birmingham, Birmingham, this Birmingham team are handy. They could go far, this Birmingham team. I haven't seen them earlier. Beating Leeds. Yeah. Kills Hostel. Chopping. Chopping veg through the zone there. Finally chopped. What's it called? Veg? Is it Julienne? When they chop Julien. it finally. Julienne. We need to ask Adam that's Perrier. The one that's, that's the one that's smaller than batons. Yeah, Ju Julienne's, Julienne's like, like the really thin. thin. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, the Frenchman would know. Yeah. Got a few people here on the stream supporting the uh, supporting the Lions, Rambo. Yep, and the Lions have someone go to the box. Number 37, is that Scott Cash? 37. No, I believe that is Scott Cash. He's writing checks as uh, buttocks can cash. Yeah, Scott Cash. Put them straight with a with a tweet. <laughs> well, you said. I can wait till tomorrow. <laughs> Here's Venla Matilla. Venla Matilla. It's a pity she didn't apply for international all stars because she is very good. Jones comes out. Jones. Oh, another static shot oh. for drop here. That hurt. There's Nick. Oh, Nick's back. Hi, Despite Nick. the victory, looking rather, rather miserable. Yeah. Just upset with life. Indeed. Getting a ribbon for going on the wrong bench. <laughs> oh, Nick. And that's rimmed hard around the boards there. Joanna Jones keeping it in. Yeah. Preventing the full rim escape in the zone. Oh, Wassel. Wassel deeks everyone, but including himself. Here he goes, setting up for that wrister, maybe. Oh, and he can't get it on, and Angus Gunn breaks up the, the play. Oh, Rory, Rory the Vicar Vickers is online watching this game. You know, maybe is he watching? You know, he's watching it in like in the watching stands. the game in the stands, but listening to the commentary. Listen to the commentary. Yeah. Clearly, you're the big draw here, Rambo. Taylor, shot. Oh, oh no! How did that wow. go in? Let's pinball. see that again in a Be super right, replay. Pinball. Let's have a Taylor. gander. I think that does that hit Hellstop? No, I think it hits, it hits whoever that defender is. It's a defender there. Rose. Yeah. Get, get it here. Forty-eight, I think it hits. Yeah, oh, it's him on the knee. No, it's that on the is. Knee. Now, if they win this game, they'll have a lot of fun about that later on, but 48 must be... Oh, his bum must be twitching like a rabbit's Rory nose Dickens right now. He's having, at home having a curry. Yeah. Is it home having a curry? What are, type are, of curry? Rory, let us know. Uh, is he home in Solihull? Like, in, in Birmingham, or is he here? You right there, Nick? Uh, he, his, bu his bum will be twi oh, twitching like a yeah. rabbit's nose as well. Nick um, Sweat. Thanks. A lot of rabbit's nose references in this, uh, this last few minutes. Break up, Wazzle. Wazzle shoots. Oh, and that found its way through, but not into the net. Kept in by Cash. But Joel Gubbins there. Good read by Joel Gubbins. Gubbins. 
if this was if Newcastle win this game, this throws this group wide open. Yeah. It's important. Here's Holstoff. Kittle's Holstoff through the zone. Scott Cash leans in for Kittle's Holstoff. Good oh. hands by Kittle's Holstoff. Angus Gunn. Miss check. Yeah. Oh, in front. Oh. oh. They seem to be clicking a little bit more in Newcastle. Yeah, they seem to be a bit more about them this time. But with the short bench where they've this, got... This, this group will be wide open if... Uh, if Newcastle can hold on here or, or even maybe even get another. They're not giving up. Oh, he's got a penalty. Oh, and Scott Cash, that was a good tackle. That was a low tackle below the waist. Textbook. <laughs> Ash Malley says Roy. Oh, Ash Malley, the guy with the good flow. He's only at home having a career because he forgot his ID. Oh. But surely he could have stayed in the rink with you. He didn't have to be antisocial altogether. You don't need ID to be a nice rink. They've got an Airbnb. Are they on the Airbnb? The Airbnb, yeah. Yeah. That's all right, mate. So look, they've got their they've got their wee, their wee fan posse behind the, the bench. The hardcore fans. The hardcore fans. Not these ones who go home. Headed up by Tottenham. Lottie Panton. Oh, nice. Nice hands. Oh, somebody smoke somebody. It's not been that physical this tier two, apart from when Leeds are playing. No, when are Leeds next up? Yeah, Leeds are next. I think, next. I think they're playing next, yeah. Oh, nice. There we go. That's a little bump. It's not. It's a little love bump. But if Leeds, if Leeds went out, just put it out there, then they would just probably start smashing everything that works. No. Yeah. Not seen that since like the Mavericks team of 2008. That's why we got rid of the third and fourth playoff. Yeah. Do you remember that ridiculous one? Not even against Coventry or something. It's not against Oxford. Was it against Oxford? Oh! oh. Could well Steiner have been. line. Could well have been against Oxford. Remember the Steiner line? What was WCW when uh, Rick, and, Rick and Scott Steiner were? That was a... Uh, the Steiners. Quite a niche reference. Yeah. I think they're real life brothers as well. Yeah, possibly. Yeah. It's like a uh, book of tea. Who's Crystal T? Don't know, but it says a very wholesome tea. Oh, Kieran O'Dwyer says, living our best lives. I'm not I'm not sure how that phrase sits with me. Yeah, see, Rory gets it. Yeah, Rory gets it. That's because Rory the Vicar is, uh, Rory the Vicar Vicar is, is a cultured man. He's a man of the cloth, the gold cloth. Specifically the gold. <laughs> 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 They've got a, a coach to player ratio on the bench of one to one and a half. The guy in the middle is running the ship. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Dave, don't make jokes like that when we, no one can hear you. Oh. Gubbins. <laughs> to to host off. I think they want the player to come out of the box and he's not paying attention. Oh, Scott Cash there. Oh. Just like a Dundee cash machine, tune up your card and not giving you anything there. <laughs> that makes no sense. <laughs> what does that even mean? Absolutely no relevance to what's going on whatsoever. Are we getting into the gibberish hour? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. We were into that ages ago, let's be honest. It's, it's, yeah. Rory Vickers has actually got a solid flow as well. And we've had we've had on, we've had Ash Malley on. He's got a good flow. David Astle, when he's he's not got the the bonnet, yeah. he's got a very good flow. Looks nourished in that helmet, like L'Oreal. Oh, and can't kick it. Fenla, Matilla, the up and under. Kittles Holstoff, Joe Gubbins now. Gubbins. Is seriously no one going to smoke Joe Gubbins? Uh. In front. Oh, nice pass to Venla Matilla. Can't find a target. Good stop there. Back to the point. Scott Cash. Good save, Eddie Thompson. Yeah. Scott Cash has got a good uh, 
He's got quite a good uh, sort of snap, you know, snap clap. Yeah. It's not it's not Solomon Smith's esque of uh, of no. the GBU and no. Sheffield Bears fame, but it's it's a good uh, snappy clappy. He's got a little something going on. Yep. After lick. Picks up the play, nice use of the body there to break that up. Taylor, it's across, Guppins, after lick, or after lack. Steps and shoots. Oh, blocker save there. Michael Smart with a casual little save. The cash clamp. Good tactical pass. Yeah. Tactical pass there. He's trying to Jumbo. use his uh, geometry background. Um, this is crazy golf that Joe used to play back in the day. That'll uh, definitely help him next year when he's the uh, AU officer of Newcastle University. AU? Yeah. What's that? The Athletic Union. So he's what, the head of... crazy golf background. Though. Yeah, it'll help him. Well, if he's got multiple sports, surely that's going to help him run an AU. Oh. <laughs> oh, 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 he's oh, that, who's jabbing it oh, in? Oh, 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 hey, oh, 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 hey, hey. Was that oh, the hey. dragon? Angus Gunn. He bought a ticket to the raffle, won the oh. raffle, went to collect his prize, fell over and smashed his face and couldn't collect it. Might not have been Angus, but <laughs> no, he said that. It was, it's number 10. Look at the guy with the snow on his bum. Believe me, Rory, I'm not sure Michael Smart had a lot to do with that, to be fair. <laughs> <laughs> oh! <laughs> that, that was a good save, though. I think Newcastle are out shooting Birmingham in this game. This is not what I expected to see. No. But then Birmingham were outshot in the last game, and Michael Smart kept him in it, and then they got a nice goal, and 10 to 4. Oh, a good block oh. there. I like the way the guy with the cage covered his mouth there when he went to block the <laughs> shot. Belt and braces guy, I can dig that. Because I've had a few more. Mm. Yep. No, well, I, to be honest, I can dig the belt and braces approach because there have been a few times where I've had a belt on and wished I had braces as well. <laughs> and so have other. <laughs> so have many others. The strain. <laughs> Clears it. Oh, and Walker, Walker. Oh, he stands on the puck. Please tell me we got that one. <laughs> oh. We actually found Dave's paddle save earlier on, which was amazing. Yeah, yeah Dave made this paddle save. It was good. It was lovely. It was a good paddle save. It was a save he had no business making. <laughs> Scott Cash, backhand. Um, yeah, if... Uh, well, maybe Ooh, Goldberg. Yeah, power, man. Goldberg is actually a good show, actually. Yeah, that, that's what I mean in Goldberg now. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, play it, please. That would be a laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Just mix it up a bit. <laughs> yeah, I like Dave with it when he does the shots. It's constant vigilance. Not, not Joe. Not Joe. It just loves the goalies and just goes oh shot. Sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dave, constant vigilance. If it's not going in, they're not going to shot. <laughs> can you do your impression of, <laughs> look at the, you do your look impression of Joe again, please? <laughs> what? what your impression of Joe doing the shot button? <laughs> <laughs> I like generous shots, Joe. I'm on you. I'm on Team Joe. Oh, good shot. <laughs> that was definitely a shot, that one. Uh, 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 uh. 
Do you know, some people have things to say. I don't have anything to say, so I say things. Or what's that effect? I've come out of here, the of Why is the dragon? Why is he called the dragon, Angus Gunn? Well, you know the Newcastle Wildcats logo? Yeah. You know how it's from the University Crest, and it's got the lion across the top of yeah. the crest? He thought it was a dragon. Yeah. And it works back well with his name. What, well, gun? Yeah, dragon. Yeah. So it's a lion on the top? Yeah, it's a lion. And that's why they go out with wild cats? Yeah, well, yeah, go <laughs> figure. <laughs> There's no specific, you know, yeah. <laughs> Are we just changing team names for funnier? Like the Birmingham Mavericks? <laughs> the Birmingham Mavericks. <laughs> No, yeah. it's Birmingham Mavericks. We renamed them earlier on. Newcastle Lions is the Birmingham Mavericks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the Lions are thinking, please don't change our name again. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Excuse me. Wait, <laughs> <laughs> Like when a goal scored, just hit the buzzer. <laughs> just brought, with me, with me. <laughs> you weren't here last week when Joe just about blew the kid eyes ears off with an announcement. <laughs> oh my, go on. It was about 40 decibels. Like, just. Yeah. in another stream, Joe was just reminding Rambo what the decibel level of a whisper was. It was uh, like 400 decibel. <laughs> <laughs> it was just pure Joe in my ear. <laughs> yeah. Vassal involved. Oh dear. Well, that was just left for Scott Cashin. Joe oh, Cummins got a nice defensive play. He's got hostels inside him. Shoot it. Oh, and he had hostels inside him there and he didn't pass. Scenes, scenes here at, at Ice Sheffield this evening. Oh. Yeah, looks like it. Oh, and and oh, and we've just had we've had words in that, that Michael Smart is the the Birmingham boy. Well, is the Birmingham Lions goalie? He's from Perth, Australia. Played for Perth Hawks when he was Played in for the youth. Perth Hawks. He's born in 1991. Weighs 174 pounds. Last place for Iowa State University in 16-17 season. Yeah, this must be a bit of a step up for him. He played for Western Australia and won uh, involved in the Brown Trophy. <coughs> Perth Thunder, West Coast Flyers. But Iowa State, excellent stuff. Under under 18s for Australia. Yeah. yeah, thanks for Nick. Thanks, thanks to Nick. Nicholas Nick Ivel for that factual information. He was my fact finder last week when I done my first ever pro game as well on commentary. Although, <laughs> although Rambo, I wish you'd trust elite prospects when they've got you down as English. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> elite prospects have got me down as English and haven't played for Grimsby. <laughs> <laughs> on loan to the, to the Steel Queens, though. On loan to the Steel Queens. <laughs> bit like, I, I was on loan that one. Yeah. <laughs> What's that saying? Skating is sexy. All right, okay. Kelly Lou uh, put down the put down the Jaeger bomb or or bomb. <laughs> Did you know that Rambo's a good skater? Just yeah. putting it out there. Yeah, I've got I've got I skate better backwards than I do forwards though. Yeah. That's pretty good, that. 
What the? Here's Wassel. Wassel. Ooh, and Wassel, he's... Burnley will just go after throw oh, every... Oh, just missed. That, that swing and a miss. All stops. All stops. Cash had the chance to absolutely level all stops. They didn't take it. And it goes behind. Angus Gunn oh, tries to play it in front. That was far too obvious of a pass. Yeah. The thing is, Burnley, Burnley are now they're two goals down and they're on the penalty kill. So they're... You know, they're in a position here where the pulling the goalie might not work. Newcastle just need to kill the game. Certainly Hold the do. Puck. Hold the puck. Nelson. <laughs> well, it's looking to me, it's looking a lot like the Birmingham team are going to suffer their first defeat this weekend. All Stavs. All Stavs. All Stavs. He doesn't seem to quite have that finishing knack, does he? No, no. Does he finish? <laughs> no, I think he's Hungarian, I think. Mm. I'll find out. I'm always Hungarian. What for? Pizza. Okay. Sometimes I like a, a, good, a good fajita as well. There's a foot race here down the ice. Oh, and flumpity wumpity. Oh, she doesn't. Uh, she looks to be in pain. Number Something nine's like checking that. on her. That's good sportsmanship there. And we'll have a stop in the clock. 29 seconds. Nope. That came up with Kirill Polk. 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 It was a brave play in the corner. She worked really hard. And it was good to see the uh, the Birmingham number nine going over to check she was OK. Game's on the line and everything, but some things are more important than hockey. Won it. <laughs> Look at that. There we go. Latvian. He's Latvian. <laughs> I like the way they've got... Uh, anyway. Second profile for the <laughs> Maybe they could have a second profile for me as a Scotsman. <laughs> <laughs> Here's Lassell. No, has Amy actually come back for a lap? Or has she made a donation? Hmm. She's been back and gone again. Okay, right. I'm, I'm, I'm calling one bullshit on one thing already. But we're on live stream now. He's not six. He's bigger than six foot two. Gubbins. Five, four, three, two, one, and this group's wide open. I enjoyed that countdown then. <laughs> that was brilliant. Yeah. Newcastle celebrating like they've won the uh, who's the who's the is it, who's the fan? Is that Sky? I never recognised Sky when she not got her kit on. like it's Leeds versus the Sheffield AC team. CA team? Yeah, yeah. I Cam think I'm hoping, game, yeah, course, Cam. hoping after this we're gonna yeah, we get cool. Joe on comms, no? No, Joe's gonna do the job. He's gonna do a job? Yeah. He's gonna fill Nick in the car park. Yeah, he's gonna fill Nick in on the car park. I wonder if I can make it to the to how, how far does this yeah. go? Does this make it? Yeah, it makes it. You can just you just add colour from there, though. It's really hard to do play by play on there. But to be fair, I don't let anyone do play by play. No, so. I just kind of when I'm on there, I just kind of <laughs> listen to you for a bit and chime in every now and again. Yeah. I don't feel I need to say anything else. Well, this game is Sheffield C versus uh, Leeds. If Leeds are anything to go by from this, mo this, early, this morning's game, I was going to say, early this evening's game, this could be something of a bit of a rough and tumble. Just like Rambo likes it. Yeah, here we go. A Yorkshire Derby. Are there any Yorkshiremen on the team? Oh yeah, Sheffield about to have some homegrown people. Oh, 
First goal in the first two minutes. You heard it here first. Leo Lepley, I'm just going to point out there's nowhere better for parents to come at this weekend. Oh! oh! Boom! And as James would say, set down. That's a 90s reference for all you kids out there. Shot from Gray, and saved by Brooks Smith. Can you name another hit song by James? Um, Laid. She's a star. Doing well there. It's too, ooh. Oh. Somebody else hit somebody. Here's Peter Toth. It's going all the way here. Oh yeah, he's gone coast to coast. Number four, just like Bobby Orr, through the zone. Maybe not quite like Bobby Orr, but you know. Some, same colours, same number. Going coast to coast. Bobby Orr would have scored though. Don't know, tier two is quite tough, Rambo. <laughs> yeah, Bobby Orr wouldn't have known how it was to get hit. <laughs> you, you'll be on you'll be on after this game. Yeah, that's but yeah. that's my we're mistake. Down, we're Sorry. Down the stairs as well. There's that like you'll see the, the banner. Here's Josh Herter, flips it in, the corner there, Sullivan, Sullivan. Sullivan was a podcast interview last season as well. Oh yeah, no, I've had real, I've, I've had real. Yeah, we're just about to do an interview with uh, Old Mango Zimmerman. With Old Mango Zimmerman on Andreas Segaris. No, down there. Down there. I uh, will be at some point. Yeah, it's been something I've struggled with this year, Rambo. I, I put it out there last year. Loads of people came forward to do interviews and stuff. But this year it was a bit, a bit quieter. So I don't know what that's about. But there's anybody out there who's going to be here next weekend at Tier One or the Women's, and you want to uh, get yourself on the a bit of screen time, you know, a bit of face time with Rambo, then uh, drop me an email. What What's the deal with this Manchester Leeds thing? That like Manchester players go on the Leeds bench and stuff. I don't know, I think it's a bit weird. I think it's quite weird. They're supposed to hate each other. Yeah, this is like, no, <laughs> nobody likes dirty leads. Hey, man, my favourite band are from Leeds. Right? They're called The Music. So arrogant, man. That would just be plain weird. It's the equivalent, though. Bit of fire, typhoons. typhoons and eagles would not work on the bench. Good speed through the zone there. Tip round behind. Now here's the thing, um, Rob. We've got to be aware of. Oh wait a minute, a chance here. Oh, I'm wasting my breath stopping for that. <laughs> um, here's Gemi. Yeah, me. Yeah, here's the thing that you've got to think about. Leeds have got a penalty point now. They have. But so have Birmingham. Have they? I yeah. don't think they got a 10. Oh, I thought they did. No, it was a two oh, minute two misconduct. Minute, two, yeah. minute, two minute abuse, I think. Yeah, two minute abuse. The other guy got oh. two plus 10 from board. I was going to say that would put Newcastle top of the green. But it certainly opens the group wide open, but Leeds are now in the uphill battle. Is this a four or five team division? Uh, it's a. It's four, four in each group, eight teams. You want to come on comms, Joe? Oh. He's cut. He's cut Rob off. Oh, he is coming on comms. We should all be privileged. Everyone stand in your house and, and salute. It's the man, the myth, the mystery, smiling Joe Staten. Welcome to the live stream. Thank you very much, Rambo. That's, uh, that's a lovely intro. Yeah, I mean, as you're a man who needs more, no introduction, but I gave you one anyway. Oh, it's a light sound of my own voice, largely. But. <laughs> so what have you thought of the hockey today, uh, Joe? Yeah, it's been, it's been a, I'm pretty good. I've been pretty impressed, actually. Yeah, it's I mean, been, uh, you, always, you always worry you start to move into tier three, tier two, and you worry there's a too, few too many hot dogs in it. Yeah. And it sort of uh, ruins the flow of the game, but oh, we've not seen nothing stupid so far. No, everyone seems to be dealing with everyone else so far. I know Leeds are a little bit upset with uh, how the game went earlier on. 
in terms of the scoreline? Yeah, I mean, they, they, in all honesty, they did dominate the game against Birmingham, but they, they couldn't put the puck in the net, and, and Birmingham got the one they needed. Yeah, and of course, uh, Michael Smart, international goaltender for sure, yeah. So. Third yeah. choice. I'm not sure he's got a cap yet, but still. Yeah, well, training with him. We had, uh, we had Wong, who was an international earlier this morning. Yeah. There's a few, and obviously we've got our GBU stars who've been floating around today. A number of them. <laughs> Dave's claims England 19. Former Grimsby Wolf or something for me. <laughs> English, Richard Rambo. Yeah, right? it's English. Dickie Rambo is yeah, like... I could have no stats on it, but just... Scotland's going to be asking for that kilt back. Yeah. And the Tamashanti. Yeah. I'm never going to be allowed to drink Iron Brew again. <laughs> I love Iron Brew. That's my oh! Scottish Brew. Oh, now we're talking. That's what we want to see. This is really the only physical team in this tournament. To be fair, 22 minutes is not like a long, a long time to want to establish a physical presence. No, no, it's quite it's a big. Like, I do like this number 45 for Leeds, though. Yeah, he's he a big is, guy. He, he knows how to use it. He's good on his skates he's as well. You watch him change, change edges on his skates, yeah. and he actually can skate properly. We got a tripping penalty. Herter going to the box and he is unhappy. Going to the wrong box. Yep. The uh, the classic wrong box of the. Uh, you, you do wonder. I mean, th these guys are are students at university. Um, I think. And and they are ice hockey players. It should be played at a decent standard. And the understanding of the rules and procedure is quite shocking. <laughs> The hockey might be better, but they still don't understand the rules. It's Peter Toth now. This is a guy, he's not available, he's out of the country next week, but he was a guy that pursued actively for IES and uh, and also found out he might be GBU eligible. It's very impressive. International and GB. Yeah. Double threat guy. Double threat, playing both sides. First and second in one team, third with the other. It'd just be a pivot. <laughs> you have to draw lots to start the game, so you close for. There's an argument going on about which rink is a dive. Which, which rink, rink is, is a dive? Do you know, I turned up to <laughs> Whitley Bay and I, I warned the girls, it's like, it's nice, isn't great. The doors aren't great. What's, why is oh dear, oh no! I don't, I, don't, I don't know why as a defender you decide that you're more important to get in front of the net than the goalie. What are you thinking? That's it, yeah, I'm, I'm going to stop you getting into yeah, the net. Parker got in the way of Brooke Smith there and... Well, give him a tap on the shoulder, I don't think he'll be very happy with you. So as it stands, it's everyone. Oh, Toth off the face off there. Tries to hit him. This is uh, Daisy Leftley. I think she's got another name, but it's just Leftley on the back of her top. So save my, <laughs> save my breath yeah. a little bit. Time to send the stream on Chromecast. Thanks for the stream today, as always. See. You all later, friends. See you later, Trig. He's an avid follower of the pod, of the um, not the podcast, of the stream. The stream, yeah. And, and apparently, he's going to he's going to listen to the podcast in reverse. Well, not in reverse, in, like the archives right through. It's good because I can hear the total low tech one that I uploaded myself, the very first one. <laughs> the pre Dave edit. Yeah. The one was so bad that Dave was like, I must edit this because <laughs> it's going to bother me otherwise. It's a good way of dealing with it. Herter. Herter goes wide. Shot. Oh, and another one. The low tech podcast, Dave. That's what we're talking about. The one that I uploaded myself. Yeah. It was all done in uh, Audacity and there was like no filters um, and all the rest of it. Oh, was it wasn't in sepia. It was, it was au natural. Oh 
you know what he's talking about. All right, okay. He meets one of us. Then. In front of our eyes, Ali Pali is disgusted. Disgusting. Actually, I like it better as disgusting. Well, I think they, they've gone with the... Uh, well, it was one of yes. That's guy's <laughs> The party was to Ali Pali. What happened at Ali Pali car park was more... <laughs> What happens in Alipoli with Alex Stacey Gally Bully Car Park, yeah. And the saddies after this. What's his name? Oh, and the old delay game signal. And uh, Sadi will find his way to the box. And he goes to the right box, yeah. He went to the wrong one, yeah. It could be awkward if Leeds were already in a penalty there, eh? I, I, nothing beats the penalty boxes at Solly Hall, though. Is that not just in part of the bench? Yeah, the end of the bench. You have to Quick. sit down at the end of the bench. You, you had the little uh, Tourette's um, there Go from the, <laughs> Here's Peter Toth. Peter Toth, head up stuff, good speed through the neutral zone. Steps up. Oh! oh, oh Herber! He took the goalie out there. Steeples is rolling about in the floor. I, I, don't know what, I don't know what the Leeds guy is getting up to Toth for, because he tripped him up. He hit the goalie, but you tripped him into him. I think he actually cross-checked him. Into him. I mean, I, I, I'm that, surprised there's no penalty call on that because that was a that was, that was quite a, a vicious cross-check by number 14 from Leeds. And uh, Steeples is getting gingerly to his feet there. And Sheffield using this as an opportunity for a tight one. Uh, it's good to see Stiebels is back on his feet. Is that... <laughs> no. <laughs> Only if it was you. I'm glad he's okay now. Can we watch? Is it okay to watch that back again now that he's, he's okay? <laughs> if, he, if we're watching the NFL, they'd, they'd have replayed that 12 times in <laughs> yeah. super slow mo. Oh, who was it? The San Francisco 49ers against the Seahawks back in 2013. Oh. Uh, NFC Championship game. And the guy, he got his leg absolutely blown out, knee bent completely the wrong way. It was horrible. They showed it like 15 times in super slow mo. The commentators were like, can you stop showing this clip? We do not need to see this. Yeah, it's they like showed Garoppolo's injury loads in the San Francisco. <laughs> Got a thing we're showing San Francisco guys getting absolutely destroyed. I mean, I'm a Seahawks fan, so well. <laughs> if you can think of it, Dave, rule number one of the internet. If you can think of it, it exists. Oh, <laughs> pain! Yard sale. Uh, tried to catch that there, and here's Herter. Is it inside? Right now, as it stands, Leeds are still bottom of the group. It was a penalty point. Yeah, they got that ten. Yep. We, I had to explain what a two plus ten penalty was. I actually it's thought still, they were, I thought they were going to put anyone in the box. There's still, still people still don't understand that two plus ten penalty is against the same guy. Someone else sits the two, but the guy sits potentially twelve I, minutes. I used to think the two, the two was personal, and they didn't. But when I was really young. No. Ask Sebastian Ronsky, he knows that I don't know what to do. give him one. I can, I can that remember. That was his first penalty this season as well. I can remember having a dis distinctly having an argument at a BUHA AGM about what a 2 plus 10 penalty was. It wasn't with that guy in the cowboy hat. The teal, teal bonder off, yeah. yeah. Those, those are the days, eh? See, I'm a, I'm a bit late to this uh, committee party in a sense. Oh, we used to party. I oh, mean, we used to party. I mean, people see me as the sort of the figurehead. We're long in the tooth now. Extent, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> the Rambo, Rambo and Small Letters Nick podcast. <laughs> it, is Nick's, it is Nick's names first, actually. Yeah, so Nick is alphabetical, right? Yeah. Well, I like the way that uh, Andy Miller absolutely bugged Nick off at the AGM. 
<laughs> yeah, you may know Rambo, he does a podcast, and Nick's just like sitting there like, yeah, I also do it. Do you expect <laughs> Look any... Look at this, minus nil <laughs> to one. <laughs> oh, good save by Do Tom you expect Richmond. anything less from Andy? And here's Toth going the other way. He goes on grey, that's sensible. I wouldn't go near 45 myself. Oh, and there was a stick in there again. He's been uh, kind of abused in the in the yeah. two games he's played. And it's obviously because his skating is kind of superior to most. He's leaving sticks in the old hook and the tug. Cross check. Pure wall. Back it goes. Here's Payne. Oh, that pass just a little bit too far ahead from Harwood, something or another. I keep forgetting the second part of his hyphenated name. <laughs> oh! oh! Turnover. Nearly punished him. Oh, and here comes Kukova. Shoots. Oh! Oh, oh, that's from behind. No. That's from behind. Oh, that was uh, silly. Hand straight up there. Oh, and that's another one down. Schuster's. Well, he's only given the cross check. I no, would not argue with that because yeah. um, that could have been a two that. plus ten. That was right lucky in the numbers. Boy, lucky boy. There's, the, you know, there's a lot of players in tier two and in tier three that just don't play the game. Like, no, no, when you could have had a worse penalty, and and just be quiet about it. Just take it, yeah. Yeah. Back to Sadi. Oh, good blocker stop there by Herter. Some fine skaters in this Leeds team. Here's a Sadi. Wang says just a two in his opinion. Uh, well, it could have been a two plus ten. Though. Like, I'm not saying it, it should have been, but it could have been. Oh, and Sullivan creates a chance. Oh, oh and Sullivan oh, can't find it. Cracking effort from Tov on the turn. <laughs> Don't tell her the words and stop singing, my singing's terrible. 95 is the uh, shot count, and of course that's why I was doing Dolly Parton. Cheer, Peter Toth. Oh. Shot! Oh. I think he just needs someone up there with him. He, had, he did have pain back door there, but... I'm sure everyone's on his wavelength. Mm. Here's Herter, he comes streaking out the zone. Oh, oh good turn by Herter. Shot, nice good save by Brooke Smith. Oh! oh. I like how he, he got like, he, he made the hit and then he got like tremors and then fell over. <laughs> oh, pain. Oh, that's nice to find Maguire. Maguire. Oh, that's. Oh, look up, look up. Lefty's after it. Here comes Daisy Leftly up the wall. Good man. Wilson. Wilson shoots. Oh, blocked there by Krikova. Parker flicks it off the wall. Robson. Here's Leftly. Comes in. Oh, that could have been a nice collision. <laughs> Oh, good block by Daisy, Daisy Leftly there. Three on two. And here comes the pain train. Looks a bit lost there. Oh, it's like slowly brought it all the way out and then plays it soft past the, the guy on the point. Could have been interference there on Stag in the middle. Sadi kept it in, but he's Stag breaks up and then they come the other way. Stag does well, stay on side. Gemi. Oh, that was uh, hideous. 
Pops in the back of the net. Ticked down below three minutes. We'll have an interview after this. I say we all have an interview after this with old man Gus Zimmerman. Is Gus coming back? And Andreas Sagaris. You're going to yeah, make him down, walk up? down the stairs. Oh, you're down the stairs. I'll say you're not going to make him walk up the stairs with the crutches again, are you? No, no, I told him to stay down the stairs the first time he came up to find out it was wrong. Boy, here's the hero. Joe Govins. Goal scoring hero. Don't, 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 doesn't uh, Amy owe you a beer now? She does, yeah. Amy Rasp, uh, Amy, I mean. Don't you do it as well. <laughs> that wasn't even intentional, that one. Here's Send Toth. Peter Toth. Good speed. Oh, that's a good defensive play. But jo Jordan Sutherland. Oh, nice Sullivan, Sullivan. Picked up by Toth. Toth keeps it in. He tries to fire it. Herter gets it. Oh, and Gemi takes a shot and that goes wide. Absolutely nothing to separate any of these teams in this group. That's really close. Tomorrow, I think there's it's one. Is it one game each tomorrow? Yeah. In the group, it's going to come down to penalty points, goal difference. Well, two one nils. Possibly. The, Steps in, less oh, than a minute left, and Sheffield don't look interested in getting the goalie off. Maybe half. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> that was the most inopportune time yeah. for that to go off there. Oh dear. It's Leftly. You have to have a look at this clock. Oh, and Leftly up the wall, it goes out. Here's Payne. One on two. I think he realised it was Krikova there and decided... <laughs> yeah, I'm going to go yeah, inside. I'm going to go the other I way. I don't think Gray is much, a much better option, but... Yeah, I've not seen Gray throw Gray. the body quite as much as Krikova. Yeah. And they're holding it in there, and it, it really... They're wanting a whistle at Sheffield. Oh, oh. and it's cleared. Yeah. And that'll count down to... to yeah. the end of the game. And Leeds have won, so everyone in this group has a win. It's 2 one nils. Two one nils, a two nil, I think. It's close. I think, yeah, I think I think oh, Joe Gubbins made it two nil in their game. Joe Gubbins, yeah. He, so I think Newcastle. Joe Gubbins could be the difference. New, Newcastle top the table right now. Joe Gubbins could be the difference between the, two, the sides in this group. Yeah. Yeah. So um, we have a nice cut and then we have two more games. Um, but before that, we have an interview. So I'll go and get my interview mics and earpiece. Yep, I have to change the battery on the camera. It's gone flat. The one down the stairs. The one downstairs, yeah. Right, OK, let's, let's, uh, let's, well. let's make that happen. And uh, we'll be back with you shortly.
And so I'm joined here with uh, GBU International and Imperial Devil Andreas Sagaris and uh, old man Gus Zimmerman. Uh, so Andreas, that was uh, one of your first games at Nationals. How was that for you? Oh, it was good. Yeah, good to get out there and um, you know get on the ice, get those first few shifts in, and experience it. And uh, you know, looking forward to the next few games for sure. Okay, and how does it? What was that? What was it? Oh, sorry. And uh, how how did that compare to being over in Russia with the GBU squad? Um, yeah, it's definitely a different pace, but uh, you know that's not to say that pace out here isn't good. Um, you know, it's just uh, getting used to you know how everyone on the team's uh, you know moving out there and and uh, you know just again getting my legs underneath me. I haven't played in a few weeks, um, so yeah, felt good. And uh, Gus or Carl, whatever you prefer. Gus, Gus is fine. Yeah. Um, you did it on You've been at many nationals, I think. Uh, how, how do how do you think nationals have progressed since you started coming? You need some better. Yeah, I think the level on the, uh, of kind of players stepping out in the ice has uh, increased. Uh, guys that we have in kind of. Uh, tier two now, you know, they're really good players, um, even on on the other teams as well. Uh, and the beginners are stepping up. It's good fun to watch the beginners as well. And uh, there's a few individuals who make nice plays. It's an enjoyable experience. And uh, next week we've got the big one. We've got the uh, IES GBU uh, inter well series uh, next week. Um, are you looking forward to that? Do you play in last year's one? Uh, no, not last year's one. Uh, I was away, but uh, yeah, looking forward to that this year for sure. Um, you know, I've got my hotel uh, booked and everything, and yeah, just excited to get back out there with the boys from Russia. And um, you know, just any, any time you can get out and have a skate with them is a good time. So yeah, definitely looking forward to that. And uh, uh, of course, Gus, you played in last year's one um, and uh, played a really good game, but unfortunately came up short against GBU. From your perspective, uh, what can uh, Andreas and, and everyone expect this year? Group of guys who look like they're hard working, uh, not necessarily like the superstars of each of the teams, but we got kind of a mix of guys who can play the body as well. Uh, so we'll see if we see the uh, shenanigans of last year's repeated. But it's a blessing in disguise that I'm not playing, so I don't get uh, shown up by Andreas. You know, he kind of makes a fool of myself when I'm at training, at least it won't be on video, you know, so. Not too hard on yourself there, guys. And so uh, just a couple of things before we go. I'll go back to you, Gus, just quickly, but uh, of course, um, Seeing your number 13 on someone else is a bit weird. A number I think should probably be retired from Imperial. But could you have a better guy to wear it for you this weekend? Uh, he deserves it, 100%. I, I'm actually numbers. I actually started off as number 17, and uh, number 13 had been retired. Uh, but we got with some of those retro jerseys, and I just thought, you know, this guy's long gone. I'm going to take 13 as well. Controversial. Uh, Andreas, I think he scored in, uh, in Russia as well. Or have I got that completely wrong? He did, yeah. So um, tell me, what was the feeling like scoring in a, a big tournament like Wugs? Uh, it was an incredible feeling. I, you know, scoring the first goal for us against um, Switzerland was just a great feeling. We were, you know, not uh, we hadn't scored yet, obviously, and we were down three nothing at that point. And just to get us out on the board and and just get some confidence in everyone there that you know we we can play at that level and we can compete. Um, but for me personally, it was uh, it was great. I, the last games I went to, I, I didn't score, and um, you know the coaches were expecting me to you know, step my game up this time around, and, and I was glad I could do that. Excellent stuff. And before you go, is there anyone you want to give a shout out to? Obviously Matt Bradbury for picking you, but anyone else? Uh, I mean uh, the boys at Streatham, uh, coaches at Streatham, just given me an opportunity there to, to play for the last two years. Um, so uh, Coach Cornish and, and Graham and Don. Um, yeah, and everyone back home as well that uh, you know I've been playing for years back in Canada. So, um, yeah. Two. Just the uh, the rest of the Imperial lot. Uh, I know a few of them are watching on a live stream, and uh, they had a really good showing at the other tiers as well. So, uh, thanks for the support. And anybody else who's uh, staying up and watching the hockey, we'll try and make it uh, as entertaining as possible. Thanks very much, guys. Good luck for the rest of the tournament.
So, uh, back to the action now after that lovely interview with Andreas Segaris and uh, Gus Zimmerman. Uh, two fine hockey players and two fine gentlemen. And I'm, I'm thinking we're joined by Bristol Dave next. England under 18 international, because let's be honest, the Leap Prospects have sorted everything out. All oh, right. <laughs> Bristol. Yeah. Look at the hair in that boy in the box. Get, Rob, get me a close up of that guy's hair in the box. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, we're on wide angle anyway. So we're about to get underway here. New Northumbria found their way to the right bench this time. After being told, look, Nick's still having a wee look up here. It's looking for clues about life. And we're off. Cowburn kicks the puck up. And I'm joined by Disco Dave Rogers. Hello. Hi, Disco Dave. Here Order on the dance floor, Rogers here. Hey, I just about survived running those last uh, couple of games, didn't I? You did? No yeah. thanks to Nick. Oh, and that's a great pick up there. Shot. Oh, and the house at Brooksville. Flashes the glove. I'm glad we've got that. Look at this seamless replay here. What a save by Brad Brooks there. Hello, again. Shades of Dave Rogers from this morning. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm alive. I, got, I, I went to get an apple earlier on. Look at the gunk on it. Oh, nice. Gunky. I'm sure those are those from last year. Ooh, good it? save. No, it's, it's quite firm. Ooh, some wrestling in front of the net there. Little uh, little slash after oh, by uh, here's Adam Perrier. Well. Yeah. Oh, good save by Nathaniel Bell. Nathaniel. Oh, what time? Oh, it? big hit there. Did you know it's half past eleven? It's oh, half. bit of a wet we are, patch we, there. We are <laughs> a very wet time. patch We're there. Ahead of time here. Yeah. We got two games left now, haven't we? Yeah, well, this one and another one. Yeah. That's us. For Who's on the next game? Uh, Imperial and Mavs. Mavs, okay. Imperial Mavs. <laughs> no more Rock'em Sock'em leads tonight. Oh, I, yeah. Have they not got like a triple minor for like going off the wrong door and not having anyone from Penalty Box? Where to choose? Being Nottingham. <laughs> Ooh, the book right there. Does that Love mean Perry? Tejas. Oh, and that's how Tejas that shot. I was trying to get outrageous and mix it with Tejas, but didn't want. Oh, that was a good, uh, good shot there, good block. I got right off tickle in that play. I'm going to have to cough again. So yeah, right, there we go. <coughs> <coughs> right old tickle in my throat. Oh, shut up. Yeah. Oi, oi. The government will go take my cider. <laughs> oh, you can't read all right, but <laughs> that doesn't really matter. <laughs> I've got a brand new combine harvester, and I'll <laughs> give you the key. <laughs> do, 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 do. Come on, let's do together in perfect harmony. <laughs> I got 20 acres. Does that mean we'll not be able to upload this because of the the uh, <laughs> oh <laughs> the copy? Yeah, right? gonna get monetized, demonetized. We get de what? Our feeds are monetized. No, but oh, that's right. what it, it flags up on. And then you've got to 
remove the audio and it takes an age and you don't even notice until someone says, oh, where's the last game gone? Yeah. <laughs> oh, so we've got to remove that bit. We've got to remove the bit of the game. No, no, no. They, they can... Um, Just remove the audio? Yeah. Because it's, it's all done automatic anyway, so um, companies hold the copyright. Um, well, they lodge a copyright claim sort of thing. And as far as I know, there's... Um, it's all just done off algorithms. Algorithms. Yeah. Like what you do to rank nationals. <laughs> what you mean sort by? Sort by points. <laughs> Shot. Oh. That went right oh, through the crease, really didn't it? Yeah. Well, it didn't go through the crease because that end up in the back of the net. Yeah. You know what I mean? Glassby. Ah. Lawson Glassby. His uh, his brother was announced in the GBU men's team. Yes, I will get those up on Twitter and Facebook at some point. Yeah, Maggie Benson's already mentioned me to find out when the IS rosters go back on Facebook. I mean, they've been on already, but... Yeah. yeah. And guys, buy your tickets. Buy your tickets. Come yeah. on, come on down and have a watch. Good Friday. Yeah. How, how, nice how else out. are Dave and I going to go to Magaluf? I know. I mean, we don't really I've already booked the flights yeah. and everything. Nick Ivo. Although I have booked two rooms because you're snoring, mate. <laughs> That's what the extra money's for for my yes. Second room. I was to get one of those breathing things for you. <laughs> turned my... What is it? Sleep at me or whatever? Yeah. Well, it's to turn my, my snores into... Yeah. Is, is it not the re relaxing sound of whales you want? Like... I think that's what a whale sounds like, is it not? <laughs> I don't know. You don't sound like that, mate. <laughs> no, I know I don't sound like that. Channel. Uh, no, that was Alison Brain dumping it in there. Sound like a whale snoring, maybe. Lasible, Alison Brain. Holds his own. Well kept in. It worked Prince. to keep that in, but they did it. Out oh, there's no one there. No, it was to the point. King! Shoots. Good oh, shot, the point, too. Saved by the house of Brooks, bro. <laughs> Stephen Brown. Stephen Brown up the wall. Oh, this has turned into a bit of a game of uh, ping pong. Mm. And, uh, Territorial battle won there, the kicking battle. Yep. Won by the Sheffield what Bears. Straight touch from out the 22, yeah? Yep. Attacking line out. Yeah. Well, well probably on the 10 metre or something. Right? Yeah. For that sort of distance. Yeah, what would happen there is we'd miss our jumper and then uh, be really frustrated. Yeah. Should take the punt. Explain the hooker. Blame the hooker, I was going to say. That wasn't even over the red line, I don't think. And the referees are tired too. In fact, Joe, that's what you normally have to do, isn't it? Explain the hooker. <laughs> can we can we say that? I think we just did. It's 23.33, I think we're allowed to the odd I think we're blue right. joke this sort of time, <laughs> isn't it? It's not that blue. No. I'm genuinely talking about no. rugby. Not much of a joke, I know. <laughs> I do try. Oh, that rocked him a wee bit. But <coughs> this Unwin guy, he's got layers. <coughs> oh, no, that's Onion, isn't it? Sorry. Sorry my bad. I must say, this is a very clean tier two, you know. Uh, yeah, it to is. To be honest, there's been a lot I of sensible you know, play yeah. of the body sort I think of thing. The, maybe the, the game times are a bit short for people to get stupid. Yeah. And, and also, as well, the... You know, teams realise how important each game is because it's a short, really short four. four. Yeah. Oh, oh and Adam Perrier with the goal there. And I think that oh. was assisted by Nicholas Ivo. Of course it was. Of course it was. Let's see that. Let's see that from the back cam. Oh. Yep. 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 That's actually yeah, one of the I Nick's think, most yeah, exciting highlights. That. Yeah, I can see Nick just there. Yeah. yeah. To be honest, actually, I think Adam took a shot, defender touched it, took another shot. So I don't think Nick should get a, mm. should get an assist for that, should he? I think I think he will be awarded it. Yeah. Adam Hans is, is very hands on actually. <laughs> well, hopefully the stats for this game are correct because the last one that Nick was playing it was atrociously done. Did you get the score right at least? Like got the, the score King, right. The Kings haven't lost or something. No, no, no. I got the score right because oh! that's when I figured it out. Oh, that took a weird kick. Because like I got the penalty called, 
and started putting in numbers and they were like penalty to so and so I was like there's not a number for that so I just put whatever was close and the score went in and they gave three assists you know two assists and whatnot I was like none of these numbers are there I was like ah oh, that's what's happened so then I um last week oh that was wide had my old blue screen of death just froze for a bit yeah. figured out what was going on and then just gave oh, up on the game oh, sheet Tejas gets a two for one there Glassby, oh, and he hits the post. The slap shot. And Sheffield Bears coming through. Oh, that's oh, a oh, two minutes for Lumberjack. And a, and a hook. And a hook and Good bit of stick. Anything else you fancy? Glassby knows he's got the bench. <coughs> knows he's spending two minutes in the sin bin for that one. Easiest way to get on the game sheet, really. Yeah. Hook it. Just, he's just getting hook it. Lovely. Who's that going to be getting a delay again then? Because who should be in that penalty box? Mm -hmm. Well, you're not got anyone in that penalty box down there. Leeds. Leeds. Oh, good block by Christian Johnson there. Bagley. Back to Bagley. Bagley back in the zone. Oh, it's broken up well. I wonder if the hits will start flying tomorrow when hangovers come in play. Come into play. Yeah, but then will they still be hung over at like. Four o'clock in the afternoon. They should be. If they're doing nationals right, they should be. <laughs> I say that, I don't. Well, I don't ever do it right. Oh, and way. Adam Perrier, Topics and Bagley's on top. Of that, is, that is one way to keep Perrier from doing anything, isn't it? Just lie on top of him. We've actually forgotten he has a real name now, haven't we? I'm just like, he's just accepted now. He's Adam Perrier. Oui, oui. Dungeons and Dragons hockey games all at once. Life is good. I've never played Dungeons and Dragons. I have. I'm terrible at it. It seems Got like, no imagination. like every time I watch um, a Big Bang Theory. Um, first and foremost, I'm mainly watching it for Bernadette. But secondly, um, it's uh, I just don't understand what Dungeons and Dragons is. That's a role playing game. Wifey enjoys it. <laughs> hmm. Hi, Hannah. Yeah. Not as much as a good old-fashioned game of care plunk. <laughs> oh, we're all about the Apex Legends on PS4 at the moment. Here's Adam Perry, dumps it down nice. Now, kill the end of the penalty from Lawson Glassby. <laughs> Unwin. <coughs> Unwin streaking through the zone. No one really making a smart move on him, though. No, carry oh, Good skating, shoots. Boom. Bad Brooks. The Brooks wall. You know what you're getting with the Northumbria team, really, don't you? Yep. Brooks at the back, Perrier at the front, and Nick nagging for the assists, basically. And uh, Lawson Glassby. Oh, just uh, there. Yeah. Just, just to keep things moving. Just there for the ride. Oh, good oh, save. Good, good save, good reaction. Oh, and he sat on his head. And he huffed and he puffed and he sat in that house's head. The house that Brooks built, you see. Yeah. Tie it all in, neat little package. Yeah. We're almost, we're almost done. Yeah. It's all right. James Bonner's asking, in the unlikely event of two or three teams being tied, level on points, is the common procedure head-to-head -head and goal difference then the Andy Miller coin flip? No, it is penalty points is the first tiebreaker. Mm -hmm. and, and then, then I believe it's goal difference. Yep. And then it's goal scored. Yep. And, and then, then it's a coin still, flip. Yeah, then it's coin flip. Or the Miller tosses. Well. And if the and if the coin lies li uh, lands on its side, we it's just uh, we just give the we just give the other team the final. Isn't it a hundred meter dash? Hundred meter dash. Yeah. yeah. And if that doesn't do it, we'll yeah. Best fancy dress. Yep. <laughs> Best fancy dress. That would be quite good actually. Yeah. How was um last week's? Uh, were there any uh, bits of fancy dress? There was, it was uh, superheroes or something. Superheroes. And, uh, one guy dressed up as somebody from X-Men and I had no idea who he was. <laughs> like, came in, oh, like, I'm dressed up as this. And I'm like, I have, I have no idea who you are. You dress up as Gus as a moment. I did. He is the real life superhero. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. 
You've just been called a gent, Dave. Yeah. Can, can you make sure my phone's actually still charging, or is it just... You just rub the, rub the mouse pad thing. Yeah, that'll do. Yeah. Might be. Yep. This is quite a... It's quite a, like, sort of mild-mannered affair. Mm. We need a bit of aggro. It's a Saturday night. There we go. A little bit of... Oh, except it makes sense for you to be called a gent. Oh, and Christian Robinson there. Oh, and oh, some after oh, this. the goalie. What's going on here? Hey. Oh, the goalie. Oh, and... <coughs> oh, and... Uh, silliness. Silliness. <laughs> He's lost a tatty, this boy. Cuddle time. Oh! Two nils the score. Yeah. Oh, a little hook after the... Uh, do hook too. Looked like Perry gave uh, Sheffield fella a hook. Oh, I think Perry's won the ball. Oh, he's 55. He's a uh, cowboy. Uh, he really. Uh, Perry. I know they were on the, the wrong box. bench last time, but hmm? Perry's went and so's number 58 for oh. Sheffield. And it wants a word. Glasby's over with Barras. Two's each. Clock's off. Clock's off. getting. You know, it's 72 nil. Yeah. I like this. If you just watch this, it's entertainment in itself. What's it going to do next? I think Joey's going to set up a camera tomorrow so everyone on the live stream can enjoy it as well. We might even just forget about Has the he hockey. still got that camera thing that was meant to follow the time? But that was the plan, and this could have not happened. Well, it's probably for the best that that's not. Oh, 22 nil now. Yep. Oh. And it's an offset in minors. Mm -hmm. Four and four. Puck drop. Well, he didn't really miss there. much after the replay, just a little bit more nah, you didn't grumbling. Miss much, yeah. it was no, it was a goal. Was a goal um, yeah. Joe's just not. Yeah, Joe's just not put it's it on the. He's not uh, been put system. on yet. Joe's had a Joe. lot to do. It's not like a sort of Dave situation where he's just forgotten. It's like. He's had a lot to do in sequence, in order. Good block there by Charlotte O'Brien. He's tired. All they right. didn't start doing that. They stand in the middle of the ice. What's that? They stand in the middle of the ice, did they not? Mm. Mm. Uh -huh. I can't remember, to be honest with you. Maybe they did. I don't know. Second penalty, maybe? No. Yeah. Right down. Here's Prince. Oh, and the shooter oh. formerly known as Prince. Oof. Oh, and he's uh, he's uh, going to get up a bit slowly there. Nice. Oh, and, <laughs> oh. and this is where the silliness nice begins. Offside. Bagley. No, 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 no. Oh yeah. You think Bagley? He's had a year with the Bears at least, and he'd have time to sort the sock situation out, wouldn't he? Where did he come from? Was he up before? Was it? No, no. He's. I think he was Sheffield last year. Sheffield. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So we don't know who scored. It was it a goal. Well, yeah, we know who scored. We know which team scored. We don't know who scored. And um, all right. Forty-five, forty-seven. And the referee's got a little bit too obsessed with the old penalties, and so uh, yeah. So deci it's decided not to go for the face centre face off. And Christian Johnson with the with the goal. Late night hockey, guys. Just roll with it. <coughs> you putting your details, Dave. You trying to steal my identity? Oh yeah, because that's what I start with. Yeah. Right. <laughs> We're getting there, we're getting there. If anyone knows my password, please let me know. You set your password.
and then go. On, you know how to do it, don't you? Yes, I know how to na navigate my own website, my friend. No, you don't know how to get into your own website. <laughs> right, who are we looking for, Joe? Uh, it was Christian Johnson. Robinson, sorry. I keep saying Johnson. I have no idea why. Uh, it's because he's a GBU player. Yeah. Come on. Oh, I hurt this website. Come on. So you can use the screen. Scroll, 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 scroll. Shot! And saved by Brooks. He's down as 35 in both. He's down as 35 in both, yeah. Th 35 from 47. 37, he means, then, probably. Uh, no, it's not. It's uh, 54. Yeah, I have no idea how they're this uh, out of whack. Perry. Shot. Good save. Oh, and through came Tejas, and that's up off the Ooh. netting. Well, we'll have a word with Nick when he comes up about this. Yeah. Get the inside info on it, is it? Richard Wang saying, sure, I presume, yeah, Sheffield got a rough in the penalty. And I think uh, so did. Yeah, I'm sure. Cross-checking cross on sportsman, like. Two's up, anyway. Yeah. Glassby shoots. Oh, I could see from Nathaniel Bell there. Have we, got, have we got a shot count, Joe? Eight, seven in favour of the Kings? Yep. Just to answer Tony... Uh, Prowl's question. Uh, shootouts only come to play in the playoff section. Yeah. Uh, part of the uh, tournament. So we do uh, best of three. And then seven best of three, three and then... Double eight. I think they might have just changed that this in this book as well. Just just after we changed it to comply. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, we still do, last one, we still were doing the, you can take as many shots as you want. When Sundar is CG, uh, it is next Friday at I Sheffield. Uh, women's game faces off at 2.30. Men's 5.15, I think. That's, That's Good correct. Friday, so Hashtag Good Friday. Yeah, hopefully pop. you've got the day off, so come on down. Yeah. Um, Adam Perry shoots, oh, and a jumping save from Nathaniel Bell there. Just because Rambo's terrible at promoting, uh, Tickets are six fifty online if you buy them uh, before the day of the game, and then seven fifty on the day. Uh, excuse me, have you seen the traffic to our Facebook page since I, uh, I started being active on the social media? Yeah, no, you did a good job, but I mean, I'm on, on comms today. Yeah, I want you banging on about it, mate. Oh, sorry. Buy IES tickets now. All right, now. If you go on to GBU. Tito. No, GB ticket. No, GB ticket. I can't even remember. If you go onto our website, T. No, no, no there's, a, there's a link through there. Right. Check out on Twitter. I think it's pinned to the top of the uh, Twitter page at the moment. Yeah, it's also uh, pinned to the top of our Facebook page at the moment. Yeah. So. The event is, and if you go to an event, you can get the ticket information. Ah, oh, just Richard, just move, move back to Manchester. Well, Although the game's you, in Where do you live, Mr. Yeah. Mr. Wine? Yeah. Because that seems, without, without the, with the greatest respect, it seems like a kind of rubbish excuse. Yeah, terrible, terrible. Oh, and through it goes, here's King. King. Plays it off the wall. London. Ah, oh, isn't that? That's not bad, just, it's fine up, there's plenty of folk coming from London. Yeah, just jump in with one of those. Take, take a weekend, make a weekend of it. Yeah, come see Sheffield. Yeah. Put, Lovely. Your, put your hat in the ring to, to referee or something. Yeah, Sheffield, it's got some entertainment. Yep, it's got some hills, isn't it? It's bound to be a Sheffield Wednesday or Sheffield United game on. Yeah. It's got Joe. It's got Joe. Miller, normally, if he's not aware Class of the wedding. Oh. Miller's dog. Miller's, yeah, we've got Miller's dog, we've got um, Hunter. Hunter, yep. So many things in Sheffield. Yeah, and how you doing, Hunter? Yeah. Do you share a few bits? <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. It's just getting excitable. <laughs> isn't it? Jumping the gun. <coughs> oh, 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 oh! 
We might have a chance in front of the net. Oh, good save there. He's lining an under 13 game the following Saturday. Yeah, but 5.15, you'll be finished at 7. Back in London, 11 o'clock, fresh, ready to go for under 13. Yeah. Just phone it in. Isn't it? I would put you on to line the game. Yeah, we could. Why don't Why don't you, you phone your allocator? Say, I need this And game. say, I need to be on the, the Good Friday 8.45 game. <laughs> so yes. I can buy yeah. a ticket to the games later on in the day and feel it's justified. Yes, so we do have... Adam Perry, oh. breakaway, opportunity, shot. Oh, and that's a good save good by save. Nathaniel Bell. Coburn. Good challenge on that, wasn't it? Yeah, we do have to start the... To start oh, the Friday off. And, uh, Adam Perry have not once. It's nope. a bit silly here. Yeah. Nope. It's almost as if these teams have uh, played each other a few times before. Maybe yeah. they don't like one another. Oh. Harry, hey. He's very grumpy. He is a bit grumpy. Yeah. Maybe since you spelled his name wrong in the announcement earlier. I spelled his name wrong, did I? Well, you did. I mean, technically you did. You just copy and pasted it from me. Yeah. You know, you didn't and I asked you to check it twice. You didn't do once your yesterday and once today. You didn't today. do your due diligence and, and then you put it on wrong. That look could have killed, like. Imperial are on now. Good timing on the question. Or just not a very observant. Ooh. Imperial on um, with Nottingham Navs. Not in the Mavs B. No sign of any shoes yet. No. To be fair, I think everyone's leaving. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Forty-five people still watching. Forty seven. Rambo said I spelled it wrong. Of course he did. Rambo says a lot of things wrong. Just got to roll with it, guys. You gotta take your time. You gotta say what you He's say. still salty about the uh, what technological troglodyte. Yeah, call me technological troglodyte. I even know what troglodyte means. Uh, it's because I forgot the word leadite. <laughs> he's in the Ministry of Sound, so he's going to presumably go and sit on the throne and watch this game. <laughs> Bail back. Except if he starts applauding and cheering whilst he's sitting on the throne. Like he's, he's like working that poo. <laughs> hey, you've got to take pride in these things sometimes. You know, you made that. Oh, you made that. Richard Wang's off. Yeah. Oh, yeah, <laughs> delay a game, isn't it? Here's <laughs> Zimmerman. Zimmerman. Oh, cross ice path. Oh, one, two. Oh. No, all. So this, this is the ice hockey weekend. Shot. Oh, he, he, and Andreas Segaris back door there. Who's, See? Who's the guy wearing Diego's top? That's the wrong one. Yeah. Oh, well, it's, been a, it's been a pain now. What have you done to it? Don't you blame me. <laughs> Don't you blame me, my friend. Anyway, scores one zip in favour of Imperial. No. Why would everyone be in Nottingham this weekend? Is it Elite League playoffs or something? Yeah. Yeah, well. Nah, that's nonsense. Yeah, no, I'm not having any of that. The Devils got that in the bag, hopefully, haven't they? What? I don't uh, know. Nottingham actually made it to playoffs. Actually, I, what were the, the uh, what scores, scores on the doors? Yeah. Keep love. So. If this continues with the speed in this, oh, David Astle. He knocks him on his Astle. <laughs> ah, I like that name, David Astle. Use that. Oh, David. That's a very nice name. Oh. 
Is, now, is this Kalikov? Oh, I don't know. That's a slash. That was a slash, yeah. It was most definitely a slash. And Sam Jackson shoots. Oh. Jesse Cross falls over the blue line. It's all going on in there. Where do you get this kid from? Mexico? <laughs> that's a young blood phrase. For, those, for the kids out there, that's a young blood reference. I feel like I need to watch that again. I'm not that is a that hockey a movie time. you must watch. Oh. Yeah, I've got it on DVD. Along with Slapshot 2. Slapshot 2 is pretty terrible. Like. I know. Goon, Goon's good. Yeah. Goon 2 less so, has but, yeah. some good bits, but... Yeah. <laughs> and then Most Valuable Primate, obviously. I've not seen that, actually. Missing out there, mate. I've seen Mighty Ducks 1 to 3. Yeah. I've obviously seen Love Guru. <laughs> uh, that, that, that's stretching it, isn't it? That's a hockey film. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh and that finds its way in. Who did that hit? Defenseman? No, no, no. It Cigaris back to the point. I'm sure there was a tip of the. Top oh, of that was one, Shades then. of Beth uh, Scudden's goal there because we missed it on the camera with Rob there. So. There you go. I think Ooh, that. Was that? Might have been 91, is that? I think there was 91. a redirect off the we, we can't get the roster up though, you broke it. Oh, shush now, mate. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Brett Bruhillier. Yeah. I think I butchered his name earlier. So Sam Jackson should have got an assist on that as well, because I think it him too. Here's Cigaris. Cigaris. Oh, back to Sam Jackson. Sam Jack oh, and he just misses. Sam Jackson he may be playing D and stuff, but he loves to step up in the rush. Jam Saxon. How does it feel to be English now, then? It, it's not great. Yeah. Especially after the way we capitulated at Twickenham uh, a few weeks ago. I don't know what you're talking about. We had about, the uh, Calcutta Cup in the bag. I know what you're talking about, buddy. He was coming home. And then we... Oh, and Cigaris, his direction finders off there. Here's Sam Jackson. Just wanted you guys to win some silverware this century. I don't think it's made of silver, is it? Uh, Peter. It's made of rupees, isn't it? Rupees. No, it was made in Calcutta. Well, no, it was the Calcutta R RFC, wasn't it? It was yeah. um, Johnny. It was it not Johnny Calcutta that made it. <laughs> yeah. No, it's like I'm sure it's melted. Calum <laughs> Calcutta. <laughs> melted down from yeah, some money from Calcutta. Ah, I, think RFC, is, so. I think it's rupees or something. Yeah. <laughs> What's the Sheffield Shield? Is this like one of these things where it was like made here, like the Stanley Cup? Yeah. Yep. That's it. What, what, are, Sheffield, what are the ashes made? Is that like is that like a wicket? Yeah. What he builds? They're <laughs> made of England's shame. Oh, big hit. Yeah. Was oh, that what that's called? The bales off the top of the wicket. Oh, we no, the live stream all things I'm stupid right now. Yeah. Wait, was it Australian was it an Australian loss or an England loss? I can't remember. It was, yeah, it was England's loss. Yeah, so it was, it was the Ashes. Yeah, it was the Ang Ashes of England's cricket, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. Did you see that non-wicket the other week? Oh my word! Stop talking about cricket. Oh. You're English now. You should be joining in, mate. Oh, it, it nicked the wicket. So it was. Uh, I think it was the 2020s. You know where they got the flashing lights? Yeah the wicket so the yeah, lights Alan. went off but be, and it, it just jumped up and sat back down on the on the stumps so it wasn't given out shot yeah you've got to remove the bail you know this though Rambo as a as a strong Englishman as a proud yeah, Englishman yeah. Um, to BB Junkie um, um, this is the tier 2 or pinnacle. the championship as it will be rebranded next year the pinnacle. level mm -hmm. the pinnacle the pinnacle of university ice hockey until, well, until next week until pinnacle. next week which is the, the pinnacle although tomorrow at 2.36 arguably is the pinnacle because that's the cup season no because I'm not playing it yeah when was the last time Cardiff got a cup final in, in tier 1 uh, we've never been in a cup final in tier 1 yeah. oh we should get sorry sorry I think the last cup final thank you Edinburgh have always been the bridesmaids hopefully that will change tomorrow but yeah. you reckon 
Uh, I think they've got a chance, but that Cambridge team looks handy. Hey, I tell you what, it's been um, it's been tight down in uh, Dib One South. Everyone's been pretty damn solid. Ooh, good, oh, shot. good shot right on. Well held. What's it? What's it? Can we get a shot count, Joe? Just four two. The Nottingham goalie's only got a fifty percent save percentage. Unless he's only received two, and then oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Yeah, this boy's talking about everyone being in Nottingham this weekend. This goalie might wish he was there. I'm just watching our uh, our number of listeners or watches or whatever tick down slowly as we carry on chatting about cricket. Sorry yeah. guys. Yeah. Here we go. Oh nice hit. That was a beautiful hit check. Oh, no, wait wasn't. a minute, two minutes. Clipping! Blazy gets called for clipping. And so it wasn't a textbook hip check then. It looked like a textbook hip check. Have we got a replay of that hit? I don't know. Yeah. He's, saying, he's going in the box saying maybe he's high, maybe he's no. I think everyone's gone to bed. It is now Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Is it Sunday, Sunday, Sunday now? Yeah, Sunday, One minute Sunday, past. Sunday. And here's uh, yeah. Oh, and that's broken up there. And here comes Andreas Sigaris back down there. He's just got that turn of pace. Lovely skating technique. It's showing sure off a bit, really, isn't it? Nice edges. Back. Oh, we're looking for the back good, door, but we can't find now. it. This this uh, imperial team moved the puck well. Cox. Yeah. If it weren't for all those freak results against Cardiff, though, they'd be a tier one team. Oh, <laughs> good save by the goalie. That uh, had that some well venom in it. it that yeah. slap shot. Oh. Oh, we no. decided last week. Um, we decided last week that the Imperial logo looks like the Night King on meth. The Night King on meth. <laughs> <laughs> yep, not wrong there. I well, I kind of vaguely remember when they used to have a Stormtrooper as their uh, logo. Did they? Yeah. Yeah. I, don't, I do not remember that whatsoever. Yeah, I mean it was only sat on their website because it was a bit, uh, you know. Yeah. Ooh. Back in there. Yep. Stormtrooper helmets and London purples. And Jesse Cross. Cross it goes. All that jazz. Back check. Run. Corn. Cox. Fires it in. Trent Allen tries to pick it up. Yow. Oh. Yep. We stopped talking about cricket and we're back up to 35 now. Yep. Mind you, if the people left because we were talking about cricket, they're not going to know you're no longer talking about cricket. Well, no, obviously, our other listeners have told us, oh, they've stopped now. Rambo stopped run going on about cricket. Oh, silly Englishman. <laughs> stop it. Oh, oh, stop it. And here we go. Do stop it, David. Oh, and the wrath of Quan there as somebody takes his stick. Oh. <laughs> Nice move by Blasi. Oh, and he tried the sauce, but it's chopped down by Trent Allen. Soon to be on loan to the uh, Steel Queens, is it? I'm sure if Lynn's still listening. <laughs> ah, no one wants to talk to us anymore. Yeah, it's all went quiet. Uh, a little bit quiet. Play at night. I think I think Bearbug's probably uh, concentrating mm -hmm. on his uh, on his poop. Isn't he? Yeah. You still going, mate? <laughs> <laughs> and we'll come down after ice in. Bon Jovi in this Hello, one. Lynn. Halfway there. Score went to 156 to two. For a minute there. Oh, Lynn's still here. Hi, Lynn. You're, you're doing a marathon shift for me. This will. Hey, Dave, I've almost done it. I've almost done every game today. And oh, did you? Yeah. Which was your favourite? Your Which first game? <laughs> first one. Yeah. Oh, the one, no, the one with the glove save. 
Oh, the King game. Yeah. Yeah, that was that was. Well, a play the player final was my least favourite. No. Oh, oh, oh Sam lovely. Jackson. Lovely goal. <laughs> he is for real. What a shot. Some snipes there. Robert Grant. It? Rob Grant's still here. Is he? Yeah. It's just a bit he showed up. Oh, dear. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, he's doing the camera. No. That's what. The, oh. I don't think even I could have saved that. No. I'm not sure you could have saved it two goalkeepers, Dave. Yeah. Cheers, pal. Kalikov, nice hands. No, I'll tell you what, that Ken game was so much harder just because they, same as Imperial, moved the puck around well and were calm on their shots sort of thing. Yeah. Almost cruel. It oh, felt cruel. What, against the Kent? No, against me. <laughs> they right. were being cruel to me. Actually following up on rebounds and stuff. How dare they? It's a sinful business. Yeah. That's how I get all my goals. All, like, two of them. Yeah, apart from the one where you volleyed it, like, top corner. Against <laughs> enough somewhere. Yeah, well, I'd spent the entire season trying to use my stick and it just wasn't working, so I thought... That's why the WHF changed the rule, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, well, yeah, but you still shouldn't have counted because you actually volleyed it. They changed it to redirect, not allowed to redirect anymore. You're not allowed to basically move your skate to redirect the puck as you know, used to be. But now if it's incidental contact, it can count. Yeah, but I did it so quickly. There's Andres Saganis. Lightning factory. Oh, and David Astle comes in and tries to hit Andreas Sigaris and completely oh. misses him. I just caught that on the lag delay. I missed it on him. Shot from Sam Jackson. Oh, caught a block somewhere out front there. Andreas Sigaris, he'll step round there. He makes a pass. Sam Jackson is uh, scoring quite a few goals. A uh, couple of goals today and, and a big assist. David Astle chips it out. And I'm calling him Nick Fury yet? Sagaris picks it up. Hmm? Sam Jackson. Or does he need an L before we can call him Nick Fury? Well, I, I've already said he, he moved it down the mother ice, but um, Nick didn't think it was okay. No. Oh, Ooh. well, that went in there. <laughs> went in these shorts there. Yeah. Went in Buhelier's shorts. Oh, oh no. and will that count? Are we going? TMO! TMO! TMO gives the people what they want. So TMO! Here we are. That foot moved from my point of view. Yeah, I think it might be, it might be waved off by the officials. So in my mind, that's fine. I'm quite happy with that. <laughs> we'll see here. Yeah. We're going to get the replay while they're doing the TMO. We should get countdown music, you know, like in the rugby league. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, yeah, that's quite good as well. And that is waved, I think. Yes, it's waved. I mean, we are a footballing country. Maybe we should, you know, let that slide a little bit here. <laughs> what do you reckon? Oh, I don't know. Outside is the, the call. And the clock will resume on the on my next whistle. Contender, yeah, Eva, ready. Eva, be kind tomorrow morning, please. Is Eva playing against you? Yep. Ah, he's never going to score a goal against you. You're, you're super day. Oh, 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 Brett Buhilly! Absolute laser beam off the inside of the post. Look at this one. Boom! What a shot. Look at Thornton. He, couldn't, he didn't even have time to, to wave at it as it went by. It's not really fair, is it? No, that's that's unkind. I'm getting, I'm gaining a lot of empathy for for goalies this weekend. Yeah. Trent Allen tries to fire it in front. Succeeded in firing in front. Oh, Trent Allen again. Good oh, that's good. Good stick there by David Aston. Mm. And it goes. Oh, and that's oh, chipped out. Play. Just get it out of the zone at that point. Yeah. Cox. Back it goes. That's it round. Yeah, he plays it down nice. Joe, you might want to update the scoreboard in the uh, frame. Oh, 
just for our what, nine, <laughs> ten people watching in. <laughs> the units of fans in attendance. <laughs> yeah. Here comes Haynes. Haynes. Shot. Oh! oh! And there goes the ball. Yes! There goes the water ball on Haynes. And there goes the shot as well. I think that was assisted by David Astle, of all, of all people. Bit no. of a BIG celebrity. No love for the goal. He's, he's having to go pick up the ball himself as well. That's harsh. Yeah. Where's his stick gone? Oh, there. He left it on top to go and pick up his water bottle. Uh, <laughs> first game, just about to wander out with my water bottle and I dropped it. And Smashed it. Me what, yeah. Must be some nice snipes in this game, isn't there? Yeah. That was a great finish. Yeah. Oh! Hey! We've seen, finally seen a bit of contact. Yes, this is checking hockey. You can play the body. I mean, you can do that in non contact as well, as long as it's just moving someone about, isn't it? Yes. Sorry, was I boring? Though? No, I was uh, I was snorfing. Snorfing? Was oh! Like half cough, half sneeze. A snorf. Not to be mistaken with your snoring. That, that's just full on snoring. Are you driving back to the hotel? Um, if I'm not boxed in, yeah. Mm. I have a feeling I might be. Eh? By Nicholas. Oh, that's lost. This team just really plays for each other, Imperial, though. Plazi. Plays it to Dowdswell. Goes in the... Goes in behind the net and here's Sam Jackson. It's Imperial and breaking out the zone. Waller. That was number oh, four. Yeah, it was number four. Means. Nottingham. Oh. I think we've got a, we've got a penalty and then maybe a personal misconduct as well from the bench. So what's that, an elbows call by the looks of it? Yeah, two minutes for elbows and then, is this yes. going to be five on three? I don't know, Han's taken someone out of the bench there, so I don't know if that might be a misconduct. Well, this could be a five on three, I, I really cannot see Nottingham surviving it for two minutes. Or is it just two ten? What's going on? Two ten? No, no, it's a five on three, they've only got Fair enough. They won, the, like, I guess. Yeah, they won the face off so well. I'd be surprised if they survive this because, to be honest, this Imperial team. Here's Jesse Cross. Just dump it. That's offside. Here's Astle. Astle right, taking it for a walk. A that's carry. one way to kill the penalty. Oh, that's not. Kalikov reads that well. Yeah. He shoots right. it straight at Luke Thornton there. Oh, don't speed it up, don't give them the pack back quick, mate. Just lose it in your pads for a few more seconds. Mm. Running clock, isn't it? A lot of veteran manoeuvres in this. Oh. Steve I mean, I Kent can't wait. He can't wait to watch mm. the Devils. That's yep, honest. well deserved for the Devils. Yep. Steve Kent, of course, the most grunge man in the BHA. Oh, yeah, I'm just hoping uh, Cardiff have the pleasure of playing them in Tier 1. All depends on entries in that sense, I think. Was an Imperial impressive last week as well. Yeah. And it'd be nice to see them at the big dance. Yeah. Oh, and Astel. He's killed his penalty well, anyway. I imagine Imperial have been a bit jealous of UCL's success of uh, getting it up, getting up to, getting, it up, <laughs> getting up to tier one. <laughs> uh, did one, you know, quite so early then on in their era. <laughs> then hating it, yeah. Bob Jackson. But we've all been there. Jackson, you know, Cardiff have been very plenty much. Plenty of time down. Here. Look at the composure on the puck. Oh. Sorry, I'm just nattering away. Sagana, sorry. Ah, it's alright. This is Bihili. There is still Bihili a shot. Oh, and that goes up and hits the net, and that might they might actually survive this five on three. I think they will do. Yeah. And I think it's largely to the man who's skating off for a change now, who's probably going to kill it by making a change, David Astill. Mm. Apart from his silly giveaway, he's really taking a sting out of this with some of his, uh, his interceptions and yeah they do survive the 5 on 3 they're still composed though and well set up in the zone even you with even with it even you know what impressed me more than that was the fact that Joe managed to get both of those penalties up running off the same clock time 
He's, no, he stopped the clock. Oh, oh, he stopped the clock, yeah. did he? Oh. Yeah, she, you we're cheat. running ahead, so I mean, it's all right. I did steal 10 seconds off the team earlier when I forgot to stop the clock. Yeah, I, I saw that. that one. Oh. Yeah. Sorry. Who, who and then there was one There was one in another game where the clock wasn't stopped in the last minute. <laughs> yeah. That, and, well, and it ran for about 10, 15 seconds. That's the one I'm on about, yeah. Is it? Yeah. And then you held it to make it up and the guy from like I think it was Leeds or something was absolutely screaming at you to, to run the clock again that oh and that look at that good. play the through ball oh, oh. oh get did he actually that. touch him there it looked no, like no, no, he no, just no. waved up and he fell over no he's good here's Blasey good break up here's Haynes Haynes oh, oh. that looked like contact to the head there mm. I think Trent, Alex, uh, Trent Alexander, Trent Allen is lucky mm -hmm. uh, to still be on nice. Yep. Oh, 98, taking matters into his own hands. And uh, he will go to the box for interference. That's what made him make your point, isn't it? Yeah, well, I think it, if the ref had seen it and he got the 2 plus the, the two plus 10 for the hit to the head, I don't think we'd have seen the retaliation. But to no. be fair, from... A two-man system there. It's quite hard from that from that angle to pick that up, especially when it was just a bit behind the play, wasn't it? Yeah, and it, w it wasn't the most vicious hit to the head, to be honest with you. Cuddle to the noggin. Mm. Oh. So Joe's Joe's camera set up is uh, as intended starting to shut itself down slowly ready for the ready for the ready for the sleep yeah no comes in 20 is it, how many seconds are actually left two none <laughs> the clock went up, up to 22 tw two minutes 22 uh, but that'll do that'll do us for day one of tier two tier three nationals and uh a nice day to be honest. I, th I think it's been a, it's been a pretty successful day, yeah. despite Lord Voldemort. I mean Andy Miller being here, not being here, not being here. Yeah. It's been pretty pretty good. And if you utter his name, he will turn up tomorrow. Yeah, let's go commentary cam because we look absolutely fresh as a daisy. How is everyone out there? Hello. They're still watching us. Thirty-seven people watching us at home. Put your arm or down. wherever you're watching. What are you saying? Put your arm down. Getting a whiff. Oh, sorry. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and thanks to everyone who's watched us throughout the day. Um, we're back tomorrow at 8 a.m. Are we? Oh. <laughs> yeah, I we I've are. Got, I've got an 8.30 game, I think, so. Yeah, well, you've got an 8.30 start, have you? An 8.30 crackerjack start. Oh, dear. Um, it's <laughs> See how big my knee is then. Yeah, we've run ahead today, which has been good um, from our perspective because we get a little bit of extra sleep. I have done, of course, the old Some Saturday Some of us get a little bit of extra sleep. I You'll slept, be snoring, mate. I, I, I slept like a baby. I know you Absolutely did. Absolutely slept like a baby. Distressed baby. <laughs> 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 um, and uh, that's us as we uh, the teams leave the ice. Um, the ice surface. And uh, we wish you a good, pleasant Saturday evening. Yeah, so we'll be back 8 a.m. Uh, British summertime. Uh, well, we wish you a good Sunday morning. Um, and we'll be back. Uh, what time will we to be back here? Six a.m. again. <laughs> yeah. But yeah. First game eight a.m. British summer time. Yeah. So Tony's asking. He's across the pond. Is well, where is he from? East coast. E if he's east east coast time, it'll be three a.m. Three a.m. West coast one a.m. Isn't it? Uh, no. Midnight. I don't know. Did they come with us when daylight saving came in? I don't know. I know there's, there's a week. Really there's a week shift normally. Yeah. You know, if you Google it, you'll you'll find it. Nah. <sighs> You just, just pretend you know and it's fine. Yeah, yeah. Amy, we will look after your laptop. We'll try. Yeah. We'll try. Yeah. And uh, in the background there, we have Rob Grant, of course, wearing a trilby. Just back from the trilby holiday. tour. Yeah. yeah. Bit of a tan. Yeah, he's got a bit of a tan, actually. Yeah. Got a bit of colour about him. Yeah. yeah. Getting the sleeves out just to show it off as well, yeah. isn't it? We'll have I more. Think <laughs> we, look, we look pale as... <laughs> I'm, I'm White as a sheet. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely exhausted. <laughs> it's like 
man. It's not even funny. <laughs> no. Yeah. Our chat's disconnected again. Yeah, it's all right. We got yeah. terrible chat anyway. Uh, yeah. yeah. Now we're just muttering no. to ourselves. Yeah. <laughs> um, well, so, yeah. th see, the thing is, we've got to fill the air until d until Joe's ready to turn us off. Yeah, but he's just going to let us. All right, okay. So, everyone, good night. Have a lovely uh, morning, um, a nice breakfast, fill yourself up. Boil we egg, won't maybe. do. Yeah. Cause we are going to have McDonald's. Yeah. Cause we're going to have McDonald's. Uh, and you're going to make sure you get the right order this time. I, You were sat next to me. You're going to double check it, because that's all I want to know. Right. Anyway, good night. Thank you all for watching us. Uh, I've been Richard Ramble Gray. This has been Dave Rogers, Rob Grant, Nick Ivel. On behalf of him, we say good night. On behalf of Smiling gorgeous, smileless Joel Staten. Um, the man, the myth, the legend, we say good night. Good night. Bonwing.